All right, we're live. You can't hey. see it right now, but I'm doing Who's my gonna be first. I'm going to. Um... Who's going to be first? Share this. Can you stream your Discord? What are you talking Who's... about? Oh, should I just watch the actual live? Why would you? Why would I stream on Discord and on YouTube at the same time? So I get the actual real time. <laughs> Mark, you're not that special. But everyone watching, Mark's here. And that's yeah, that's the most important watching. thing. Others? There's people watching? It um, is, I guess. I don't know. They're, they're, they're definitely... <laughs> well, we, we post these live, so it doesn't matter. They can watch them whenever. They're up there, one watching. I'm going to click on it, though. Now I'm two watching. Now you're two watching? Um, yeah, I'm two watching. Yeah, no, we got to make a, the chat on Noisy VODs. Was he VODs? Yeah. What's that mean? Video on demand. Oh. You guys aren't good at no, it's not content. Not shut up a second. What do you mean? What do you mean? I'm a content I'm just man. Gonna sit... This is I'm just gonna sit here quietly and just like Ryuji did last time and he did such a good job at it. Bailey and I were just time? talking. The story. Wow. I know. Wow. I know now to go in full screen. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that was your. That was your biggest downfall. Yeah. You know. Um. I I want to make sure like all the audio is ready is is good to go though. Yeah. 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 I'm not too loud. You're not too quiet. Game can have to be heard. I'm sad that I have to wait a couple weeks for this dude to importing it. Oh, I I bought a I bought a copy of the game too, Morgan, uh, just to um, get that physical because I have um, made in a Blackwater on Switch, so I got this one on Switch too. We're playing it on PS5 today. Or like PSY, am I right, gamers? PS Fly. Yeah. It's a why. Why are we playing it on the fucking Series X? We're where the home. Did you get um this? Did you get um Lunar on PS5 too? I don't know why I chose Switch. I'm actually I'm actually I I did just because I thought it was cool to have it on the cartridge. But um, looking at the Switch reviews versus the PS5 reviews of this game, I can tell that the Switch version is definitely. Uh -huh. Lacking. I'm going to be playing this game on hard mode. I'm not Ooh, that good at bragging. this. I'm not very good at this game either. Azario's bragging. I'm not very good at this game. We're doing uh, the basic film only run, right? Not none of the special films. Um, no, this is New Game Plus, so I think I can, I think I hold on to all my items and stuff. So I uh, okay. Um, we'll watch the opening. Because that's what's cool. Yeah. I can tell you why you got the Switch version, bro. I'm in your mind right now. I can tell you why. Why? Because you know that Switch version is going to be the fucking rare one because nobody's going to win on Switch. Yeah, it's going to be so rare. <laughs> um, oh, yeah, man. Hey, Brian. If I get it. Oh, yeah. Brian doesn't like uh, scary games. So I'm sorry in advance. Bro, I, I, I for for a fucking second, I like, oh yeah, Brian didn't like you, Nate, and I was like, what yeah, Brian, mean? yeah, Nate, what didn't did like I do? You. What what didn't you do, Nate? Brian, lo siento. Um, yeah, let me know how the how the audio is and stuff. Um, I know that sometimes the game audio is a little low. Hey, Grim. Yeah, this uh this is new game plus too, so I'm a little stronger. And I also put the bathing suits on, so a little stronger. I think I just I think I have all my film and stuff. That makes sense because it would. I would, I would think I'd let you keep your film and then your healing items. Yeah, I'm playing on hard mode as well. Um, but okay, I think I can go full screen now. Let me know if the audio is bad. If it's if it's too much, I can fix it. But I'm gonna put this in full screen. So, what I'm doing? Yeah, I have a tendency to be too loud, depending on my microphone. I could turn you down. 
I don't know. I'm not. I I can't listen to the stream right now. I screamed during the fifth game, and I had an excellent <laughs> jump scare relating. To... I I jumped a few. There's a couple ghosts in this one that scared me. Um, oh yeah. They they have a few jump scares. You know what scared me a little more is uh, Paranormosite has a few jump scares. Oh, Wiker, Alan Carr. If I said that wrong, I'm so sorry. But thank you so He's much. Yeah. I have a tendency to not read names correctly. The best gaming channel in YouTube history. Mark needed to hear that. Dude, put me on the next rocket ship to the moon. <laughs> Mark is here. I am present. I didn't realize that was such a big deal. I'm not a spirit. Mark, uh, Mark is in an anomaly, an anomaly, <laughs> what? an am oh anomaly. Sorry, <laughs> what's up, dude? <laughs> what's up, dude? Uh, spirit hunter, ng spirit hunger, <laughs> spirit hunger, spirit hunger I, ng. Bro, you gotta fucking. Cook for the spirits, bro. <laughs> the spirits are hungry, bro. Bro. I am the nerd apparition. Oh, <laughs> oh I gotta go. So this is the beginning of the game. Um, this is. I think I'm playing as a girl named Madoka. Madoka. Um, yeah, her and her friend Yuka uh, just came to this um, island, Rugetsu Island, I believe is the name, um, and and search because they're all having like these these memories. Um, <laughs> audio, yes, there will be a review of Mato Anomalisa <laughs> Anomalies. <laughs> Uh, oh, yeah, that, that was the game you were talking about earlier in the Discord, right? Yeah, but we can't talk about it right now. We can't talk about there, it. There's, there's, are you talking about it? Like, oh there's, well, there, there's, we're going to review it, but we can't talk about it. I, I can't see, talk yeah. about it. I'm reviewing it. I reviewed oh, yeah. it. It's coming out tomorrow. Yeah. It's, it's done. So. Todd yeah. B! The video is in our Discord. The entire NP staff watched it, and we all said that review suck. No, no, I haven't even done the video yet. Don't listen to it. Don't listen to me. Don't listen to him. Um. Yeah, there will be there will be a review up. It might be tonight. They the the embargo was very loose. It was just like the tenth, and I was like, oh, okay, like any time we want. Oh. So. Oh, so it's not even like. It's like chain. on the tenth. So I could do a nine p.m. because technically. It's like chain echoes on I guess. Yeah, That's technically. Like um. Bailey's in it's New York right now, so that's midnight for me. That, that is not how time works. What are you talking about, Zara? What are you talking about? 9 p.m. for me? Or, I mean, I mean, 9 p.m. for me is midnight for you. Guys, listen. Okay. Listen, I've been drinking a little bit. Okay. We can right. tell. <laughs> we can tell Mario. you. Because it's, it's 10 o'clock for bailey doesn't mean it's 10 o'clock for you man no 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 when it's midnight for bailey it's the 10th <laughs> and it's 9 p.m for oh. me so i could post it at my 9 p.m if i wanted to uh-huh if you wanted to but you wanted to. uh like, morgan you wanted to i think this game honestly they did a way better job promoting this game than they did made into blackwater mm -hmm. um but no, for fucking sure. A, a lot of like the um a lot of like the nuanced like Wii systems. Um they did a really good job like transferring them over to to this um game. But like that like this is what you have to do to to see items. It's it, it's kind of ridiculous, but I don't know. It works. Mm -hmm. 
So I got the key. Now I can open up the door. And they do this like nice little thing. Um, I said it in my review, but the explorable areas in this game are incredibly small. And you'll be visiting the same places over and over again. Um, so you kind of just yeah. memorize everything, which is kind of nice. I'm, yeah, Wiker, I also have a uh, physical copy against. coming. I'm pretty excited. Um, yeah, let me know if I need to turn up the... Physical only in PAL, right? What happened? Is that physical only in PAL, right? Or no, it's a... PlayAsia has them. Fuck PlayAsia. Oh yeah, they, they did copy you, yeah. Um, Morgan, uh... Made in a Blackwater had multiple areas, though. This one just takes place in, like... Everything's connected. Like, all these buildings, like, you just run through them. Whereas... There's like kind of a hub place in Maiden where you go back to the office. It's fine. Um, I kind of like this style more. I kind of like, I kind of like where everything's connected and it all happens. Um, but I don't like that the three protagonists just all use the same rooms. They're always going back and forth, and it's like <laughs> they run pretty slow too. So. And then, and then I think about it. I think about it, though, because they're running so slow. And it's like, they're just normal people, you know? They don't they don't have stamina to, to take on ghosts. Why, why would they run fast? This is probably a normal person's running speed. Yeah, the only... Morgan, the only part about that office that I hated was the... The missions that took place there, where you just had to, like, walk around to trigger something. Oh, I hated it. Hated it. But we're still Madoka now. And um, I think I'm supposed to go to this museum. I have not played... Uh, corpse party in so long um uh, that original game is good but man could i not get through a uh, book of shadows in one turn or uh, in one go on turn one turn one turn man Fucking, that's how it is man that's a go sorry one brian of this <laughs> yeah i think um i think honestly uh corpse party really nails like atmosphere and immersion i don't know this let's just talk about like the scary the scary stuff that happens in that game is like kind of fucked up scary well i mean yeah it, it, it's basically like kind of like a japanese j-horror movie just in like playable game format if the name didn't tick you off there's a party of corpses and that's why I appreciate Sachiko's hysterical birthday bash. Where it's just jokes. Um, so that blue light means that there's an item nearby. And you have to shine your light on shit. Yeah, I wish... Uh, have, where was that? What's that? Um, ghost game, the, the like Paper Mario Ghost game. Paper Mario Ghost game. They just came out. Oh, uh, the one, the one inspired by it. Um, yeah. Uh, I, for, I forgot the name of it. Well, they're. I mean, they're they're going through like that whole like legal thing with like this console release. <laughs> what? Oh, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, oh, they released oh, the fit. They released the console release too early or something. There's like a bunch of bugs and it, and it crashes. The game crashes and oh boy. And the Isn't the developer like is like I think there's only like five of them. Yeah, like I feel bad for the team. Me like, too. The, the, and because I think it's because the publisher didn't like 
published a a early build by accident. I don't know what's the full yeah. story. It's been a while. Are, are they still on that? Hmm. Supposed to get a fatal frame right there, but I mean, I've never tried to get a fatal frame in the first ghost. You should. What is a fatal frame, Azar? No, I don't think I can. It didn't show up. Oh yeah, and they might lock it behind. Control. Yeah, they haven't. They haven't taught me how to fatal frame yet. What is a fatal frame? Um, uh, if I remember correctly, it's just when you when you, let when you get close, you can. yeah when they get close to you. Oh. Like if you, you hit them. shoot them right when they're about to attack. I see. Oh, shit. I'm not really noticing. Like, I did upgrade. This is New Game Plus, guys. So my camera is like completely upgraded. Sorry, it's cheating. But Madoka. Yeah. But will Magic. but will Madoka be uh, around for very much longer? Who knows? Find out. Who knows? Maybe she'll get trapped in a in a time loop, and her friend has to go find uh, find her. Madoka's pretty cool. She has a, a nice outfit. She's not. She's not really like causing any trouble or anything. The floral print, pretty nice. I think honestly, right here, she sees that ghost and she's like, "F it!" Like that's the smart thing to do. Like she's doing what you should do. She's like, "F it! I'm out of here." And and the ghosts have other. Um, other plans for poor Madoka. Magica? Magica Madoka. And they gangbang her. <laughs> Sounds about <boring. laughs> Poor ghost. I mean, poor Madoka. Not poor ghost, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I actually like jump scares in in um, movies. I don't know why. I just like being scared in general. It's a very um, cool feeling. Is it? I don't know, man. I don't know. I think it's cool. I don't think it's very cool. You don't like being scared? No, <laughs> not really. Life is, life is scary <laughs> enough, bro. I don't want to be scared. This is our main protagonist. She's an amnesiac. She lost her her um, her memory of when she was a child, but she has flashbacks of her father and mother. She plays piano. There's like a vocal theme song, right? Like I I I wrote up the the launch. Yeah, it um, goes like this. The it goes, the fatal frame. It's a, it's a really intense fucking yeah. track. Like, uh, uh, take a picture of ghosts. We go into a guitar solo. That's the theme song of Fatal Frame. Is it? Okay. Is it? I'll take your word for it. Wear your masks of the lunar eclipse. Don't lose your memory, you got. I love that I know their names because typically I don't know their names. Not what you care about, man. Well, typically, like anime too, I'm always like, that guy. You know. You know that guy. That guy. <laughs> Being scared at someone startling you are two different things. Brian, you're right. <laughs> there it is. Title. Roll credits. Oh, we're done? Oh. All right. I won't spoil it, guys, for you. I will cut the scene. And we'll get right into what everyone's here for. Bathing suits. 
So in order to unlock the bathing suits of the game, you have to collect these dolls. And there's like a lot of them. Mm. But to collect them, you have to take pictures of them. And you'll, they don't, they hide them, but not, not super, not super, uh, they don't, they don't hide them extremely, like, what am I, what's the word I'm looking for, Bailey? They don't put them out of the way. <laughs> um, but this is Yuka. She's our protagonist. She's not scared of anything. You should be more scared of her. Um, she's wearing, yeah, she, she's in, she's in a nice, uh, bathing suit. This is <laughs> looking like a freaking snack. Yuka. Sorry, Bailey. <laughs> I say sorry to me. I don't care. Yeah. Um, don't think <laughs> I'm a, I'm a very horny man too, so I, uh, <laughs> oh, no. I don't uh, apologize. Oh my, oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I need to remind you all, and and this is a, and this is a known fact among the staff, Bailey revealed close game. Let that sink in. I know it's close game, baby. I feel sneaking in. Nurses. Yeah, it's, is oh, it's it sneaking? Sneakin'. Is it sneaking in? It's uh, sinking. Sinking in. Not sneaking in. Oh, it's sinking. <laughs> it's coming in. <laughs> It's... So somebody's sneaking into somewhere. <laughs> it's coming in. It's not gonna say where. Yeah, <laughs> Nate's probably just making the gesture like, you know what where that where is. <laughs> no, that that's only weird. Hey. Never mind. Uh, what do I have to do? <laughs> Like Wait, I... uh, sorry, you you beat this game. Come on. Well, I can't hear, so I don't know if like this phone's ringing. Mm -hmm. It's not. Oh my god. Sometimes that phone rings. Uh, uh, I think I have to go up to the stairs. I know I can't go in here. I'm trying to speed run, dude. I'm trying to look for all the, the speed strats. I will say, I am not a fan of horror games, but like seeing all these Japanese post po posters like scatter across the the thing it, it's it's kind of cool <laughs> what is lie. what do the posters say Rigi? well most most of them are like the name of the room so the one where it just passed it says like muse and um, well you're not <laughs> i'll i'll show, I'll show this i'll show it right now i'm so oh okay so this is one issue with this game is that in order to actually do something like if you know where something is that's fine but you have to trigger a scene to unlock it so a door can be locked but you actually have to see the ghost go in so what does this this say ryuji kunihiko kinenshitsu or oh wait no ah aso kunihiko oh and I'll, i'm trying to put the light on it or yeah. <laughs> yeah, I can read it. Yeah, so that's the beauty of Japanese. <laughs> it might it, this might look like Chinese, but nope, that's just the kanji compound. <laughs> right. Although I will give everyone a a little like trivia, random trivia, random trivia from oh, Ryuji. You guys are oh, oh, you, oh, guys, oh, you oh, guys oh, don't oh, even oh. have to pay for this. He usually charges us for trivia. Where you G trivia? Okay. What are you singing, Mark? Okay, go. Damn, Uji cold blooded. Uji hates my guts. Yeah, Uji does hate you, though, Mark. Silence. He doesn't say anything. He just he just lets it be. Yeah. Well, I hate the guy. <laughs> what can I say? It's not, it's not a surprise among the staff that people call me a funk geek. Like, if you show me a game screenshot, chances are I can recognize the font right away. And I will tell you, I know the name of this one, and I can tell you where it's used, aside from this game. Where is it used? 
Where is it used? The, Tell me. The Wii system menu. Yes. That's like the the Wii system menu uses it. <laughs> 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 what the hell, Ryuji? Sometimes, the sometimes at 3 a.m., Ryuji will message us and say <laughs> just random font trivia. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> we just wake up. <laughs> hey, dude, I, I'm one of the people that know the entirety of Fontworks' library by by heart. So. <laughs> Is it Osaras or Sam's now? <laughs> this is not how it works. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there's I don't a. Know uh, fonts, man. I have Ryuji for that. There's an item um, in here. Where to find it? Hey, people say that's a rare skill, right? <laughs> At least that's what that's what they told me. Um, once. NJ, no good. Honestly, I hear it. I, I long live Helvetica. Fuck yeah, Todd B. Fuck yeah. <laughs> Compared to like our the reviews of like the different um versions, the Switch looks like it's not performing very well. Um, you just have also, you just have like um Switch specific sites that are um giving it lower grades than the PS5. This one this one runs really nice. Oh, hey, Mark. Oh, Someone hi, like, Mark. Long live Helvetica. Long live um, Helvetica. Ah, the font the boys. was the best one. The boys right. are back in town. Long live Helvetica. <laughs> um, so I will get, I, I, I will honestly get, um, if a ghost tries to grab me, I will probably um, lose an item. But um, I just want to let you know that... Um, it's because I can't hear. Oh, but look at my camera obscure is all the way uh Not here. All the way um upgraded. So what did you just say to me? Um I didn't say anything, Mark. Mark shot the sheriff. Mm -hmm. That's what Todd B said. No, he um, shot the sheriff. And Jay, no good. This is uh the PS5 version. Mm -hmm. The only version worth playing, I guess? I don't know how much it differs from the PS4 version. Probably very little. Light up res. Oh shit. Light up res. Okay. Not locked at 30 maybe. Uh, like I said before guys, I'm not that good at this game. I never said I was good at this game. Huh. Kind of applied it though. I don't implied implied implied. Well, I don't know why I'm not. Oh, it, it still has not taught me um, how to fatal frame yet. So I, I'm trying to fatal frame these people, and I can't do it. Um, oh wait, that's not gonna work. I'm sorry, everybody. I'm sorry you have to watch me. <laughs> yeah, we're being forced to watch it right now, Zara. This is. This is. You, know, my, you actually have to play this game on hard mode in order to um, unlock the high, the the actual good ending. So I would suggest playing it through on normal mode first. Which this game is actually pretty hard. This game is actually really difficult. Um, oh fuck! Really? Like like harder than um, for you? Because that was the last one I fully played. It's it's pretty. harder than Made in a Blackwater for sure. Um, and yeah, also there's a lot of sound cues in the game and I cannot hear the game at all. So, um, but that's on Why me. Why can't you hear the game at all? Yeah. Like... If, if you guys can't hear it either, then we're all in the same boat, I guess. <laughs> I think I have to go this way. If you guys can't hear it, I don't know how to work my sound setup. Sorry. No, it's just, I don't want to, I can turn the audio of the game louder, but I don't want it to over. Oh, uh, no, I, I get you. I get you. I'm just giving you shit. Um, so, you know, so I'm going to this I'm giving birth right now, but there's, here. there's a mini game in, in this game. I don't think I'm going to do it right now, but there is a mini game where she plays piano and I constantly messed it up. Um, 
So that's what I'm saying. There's like these little ghosts and you, and you take pictures of them. Um, but luckily they, the pictures like snap, snaps too. Um, so I never checked under here if there was a, a doll. So I'll try to find a doll for you guys. But I think I have, I have an item that tells you where all the dolls are. Is that cheating? A little bit. Mm -hmm. So every time you see a ghost, that's like an indicator to tell you to uh, go that direction. And even if a door is locked at one moment, it'll be unlocked as soon as that ghost enters. Somehow they have an effect oh, okay. on the physical world. No, I was just like in the first game where everything just has a ghostly presence locking it. <laughs> yeah, there's a ghostly presence. Um, in your presence. So that blue light, this I see. That's why I hate this game. I can't. You just have to get closer. Okay, so is that what it's talking about? No. There's an item. Oh, here it is. So you get items that way. <gasps> A ghost. Not all ghosts are bad. No. Um, but you take pictures of them really quickly, like that, and everything's okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah cause I'm sure there's a trophy we have to get uh, every ghost picture. You do take every ghost picture, correct. And you yeah, you cool. unlock an item for it? Um, you get something. Mm -mm. Probably another swimsuit DLC. No, the, the, the dolls are for swimsuits. Let's just get that. If you want the swimsuits, right. find the dolls. All right, That's all I gotta tell you. All right, well, you have to find them all, or is it just a certain amount? They're uh, so you gotta long. find like a hundred of them, I think. Mm. Maybe twenty. Yeah, uh, maybe I'm over exaggerating. But I'm playing yeah, on I mean, game I mode right now. Out of hundred. Um, so there's a, there's a puzzle that you have to do right here that's going to be reoccurring where a door is blocked and you have to, uh, find the, like, it'll show you a picture. Um, oh, I see. I missed that goddamn ghost. That's when you're supposed to like quick turn. So you can quick turn like that. Quick turn. You know about quick turning? Oh, uh, yep. Hey, Mark, we're going to Boston later this month. Yes, we are. We're going to be yes, we are. hanging out. Dick's out in Boston. Wow. Well, you're docking? It'd be like that. We have a Noisy Pixel Airbnb. <laughs> Airbnb. Um, yeah, you didn't get a bed and breakfast, man? No? No, now, now, now it sounds like, now it sounds like I didn't go all out, huh? Yeah. Sounds no. like I could have done better. Well, no breakfast. Well, I'll make, I'll make Mark breakfast. I'm, yeah, I'm hell yeah. Levels. Okay, so mirror stones are really cool because if you die, you just get your health back. So you have like two lives. There was a glitch that I encountered where I just couldn't shake this ghost off of me, and every time he jumped on me he wouldn't he wouldn't get off i felt i felt a little violated I felt powerless uh the struggle uh and i died several times and then i closed the game and i reloaded it <coughs> and i fought him off and that's the end of my that story that was a very awkward allegory Matt. hey i didn't develop this game I didn't make the rules. You didn't. Shining pump. I didn't put bathing suit DLC in it either. No, you didn't. I'd be amazed if you had that power. Um, I try. I do my best every time I do an interview. I always try to encourage. Like I want bathing suit DLC in One Piece, um, the new One Piece game, um, One World Odyssey. Yeah. Or, you, um, yeah. Get Luffy in a speedo. Yeah, sure, Luffy. 
and the rest. <laughs> um, all games should have bathing suit DLC. It not only sells copies, but like I've honestly like what there was like a costume DLC for um for Near Automata. And, oh shit, Disa, this is cool. And uh, you you had to beat the game to even use the DLC. And I never yeah. beat the game. But I still bought the DLC. <laughs> Rudy, I, I need your help for a second, Rudy. Are you guys gonna talk right. shop again? Uh, we, I will yeah, be I'm gonna go talk shop. We will be we will be moving to a to a well, it's, No, it's just one quick thing I need. Um, um I'll, actually, I'll just DM you when it's fine. Near Automato. <laughs> Brian, I haven't beat it yet. Does that make you think differently of me? Um, this is a puzzle. You have to make it equal 13. I think I got it. There we go. <laughs> I've beat a couple of the endings, but I haven't beat the... I've tried. Maybe if they release a PS5 version. They got the Switch version, bro. Hey, Laser Cat. Yeah, uh... It's, it's pretty long, and there's mul and there's multiple endings. So, you know what? It's not that bad. It's a 30-hour RPG. Ugh. Endings around eight 30 hours. 30 hours. Oh, yeah, 30 hours. I'm freaking sorry, man. Um, so, I, I have to tell everyone that we do have a Patreon that we are actively supporting and just launched last week and it's a big reason why we're able to do these streams now and it's a big reason why um we have some upcoming shows uh coming up you know what? i just realized that i can't i can't get too drunk bailey because i have to edit that review tomorrow <laughs> let's go <laughs> 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 yeah thank you laser cat it was you know what it was something that i had to be talked into because whenever we do something on the site like i like to go all in i don't like to half-ass anything mm -hmm. uh, uh, like mark uh, mark will tell you even like getting me to stream i had to go out and buy a camera and like get lights and sound like i didn't want to like have no bogus like Baby dick setup, fucking baby dick setup. Baby dick setup. <laughs> fucking mom's garage. Fucking my first, my first game room. Dot com. My first rodeo. Ga dot com. Game couch. Dot com. Mm -hmm. Um. Noisy. I think I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. <laughs> Got everything. Uh, so like with the Patreon, it's like fuck. Like if I do this, like I'm gonna be dedicated to it. I just get I just get a little uh, addicted to the grind. You know what I'm saying, Mark? Oh, yeah. You ever feel that way? Oh yeah, I feel that way every day, boy. You're like, man, I'm really addicted to this grind. People talk about burnout. <laughs> I'm burnt out of people talking about burnout. Burnt out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying, Mark? Ooh, oh, oh, dude, you talking about burnout is burning me out. Oh god. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> you're just, you're just hilarious. Laser cat, I've seen you. I feel like I know you because of how often you've like commented and hung out with us. Like it does mean a lot. Like, even Brian, like, just knowing you guys are still hanging around, like, it's a lot of fun. You make, you make, a Todd B, if you're still here. We know who you are. We know who you are. I think about, <laughs> I think about you every night. <laughs> I go down a list. <laughs> I go down a list. <laughs> what just happened? 
Mm. Oh, oh we appreciate it. Every night, man. We appreciate it. Yeah, it's a. It it takes a lot. It takes everybody to record footage, which is already fucking annoying. Um, but <laughs> it's like, uh, I don't know. Going that extra mile, I think, really helped us out. Um, also being insane. It helps to be a little insane. Yeah, you, you are insane. Uh, what was it? Hey, Greg. Do, like, mixed videos? Um, fun fact, Jahan and Jacob are from, uh, Australia as well. Um, Jahan reviews, uh, a lot of classic retro games that come out um also shmups him and i really love shmups um and jacob reviews uh fire fire emblem <laughs> what has it been man fire emblem <laughs> pokemon. The, one, the one pokemon game i took from him never went up oh oh that's my fault <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> This little kid's really scary. Uh, Mario afraid of children, confirmed. Well, he's actually... The, the hard part is when they put you in these small-ass rooms. Um, Yo, it's Greg. Greg, 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 Greg. Let me see if I can get this... Uh, wait. Uh. Oh, I got a fatal frame there, but I didn't mean to. Look, there, I did it again. Oh shit! You can you can come out, heal, go back into the fatal frame. That's what I'm talking about. I didn't know that. That's a speed strat. If you're menuing, Bailey. See, I know the terms. You're 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 fucking menuing. <laughs> <laughs> the verdict on this game, Greg. Watch my review. I gave it a seven point five. But if you're asking me to review the bikinis. 13 out of 10. Will purchase again. I ignored I ignored everybody for two days while I uh while I beat this game. You know, you were beating something. <clears throat> I was beating something. <laughs> beating something. Bro, you you ignore us every weekend though. Why why are you acting like that's a new thing? I do kind of disappear over the weekends, but then I always come back I always come back Sunday night. With a handful of videos and a fistful of dollars. Sometimes it's, it's Sunday night, and then like I'll try to get a fatal frame here. Time, this girl's pretty hard. He and it like drops all these Ryuji. I need these thumbnails, and I'm like, what the fuck? Where did you come from? Where did he come Shadow from? Realm. The Shadow Realm. I came. Is that the ring girl right there? Dude, like, this girl's actually pretty hard. Like, I've died to her a couple times. Um, Is this, like, the first boss? No, it's not a boss. It's just a normal enemy. But, okay, so every ghost attack pattern is pretty uh, different. Um, so this girl, she goes down when she attacks. And so you can't really aim right here. Because if you aim right here, sure, you can get a normal attack. But if you aim, like, right here... She's gonna go down right before the attack, and then that's when you're supposed to hit. But uh, see, there's like a there's a certain timing that you have to do to get the fatal frame. But the the window on this girl is very low. Um. So I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait to fight <laughs> someone that I know. Uh, a ghost that I know better. This girl's kind of annoying. Oh, I can use, I can show you my spirit shots too. Oh, I don't have any. Let me see. I can put them. I'd be once, uh, talking bits. Um, I have a couple spirit shots. This is like the most powerful one. 
What game had the best bathing suit DLC? Oh my gosh. Um. Oh fuck. I didn't. He got me talking about bathing suit DLC. I almost there. fucking died. Um. Huh. You know, I used I used to. Best bathing suit DLC. It's got to be like dead or alive, right? Like, even though like dead or alive is dead, even though dead or alive is dead, like I would say, even even Atelier Totori DX that Vita version. Yes, dead or alive extreme beach volleyball. That's like. That's, I don't know, that's what I, that's what I think of when I think of, like, but I will say that I, I really enjoy, like, Neptunia Bathing Suit DLC. I'll go out of my way to buy that. My thought process, and correct me if I'm wrong, boys, is that if I'm going to be playing a game for 30, 40 hours, um, might as well, yeah, I don't might as well... Put a cherry on top. That's all I gotta say about that. <laughs> yeah, Senran Kagura definitely. Um, I don't like to go just for like the, the um the known games though like I, I i'm trying to think more obscure bathing you say that and then your first answer was fucking dead or alive man yeah because i was thinking of like i was thinking of like um what like what i should what i should say yeah. um but like i'm sure i i'm sure i i've purchased something that i was like Fuck, this is really good bathing suit DLC. <laughs> I think some of the stupidest is probably Gal Guns. Love that game, but boy, some of that clothing <laughs> and some of the DLC is real dumb. Yeah, they're, they're, them running around in the snow in their bathing suits kind of mean, huh? A little bit, man. Got him uh, with that mask. Completely forgot about the man. Oh, that's the name of the game, bro. You're right. Anybody seen the new uh, Demon Slayer movie? No. I was supposed to watch it last I... weekend. But I guess it's the just movie? the last two episodes and the first two episodes of the next season. Oh. So if you're all caught up, the first 40 minutes are just like stuff you've already seen. Yeah. Yeah, that Laser sucks. Cat. So Definitely. so do watch the first do watch the last season before if you want to go to if you want to watch that movie because it does pretty much spoil the last two episodes. Um but it's marketed it's it's marketed as a movie. Like I don't know. That kind of sucks. Like you just go thinking that you're gonna get Mu Mujin Train and get the whole last the whole ending of the season. I'm trying to look for this item. I don't know where it's at. Oh, right in the mailbox. Uh, right there. Soon we're going to uh, run into Madoka. Our our first protagonist of the game. Um, if you skip the train movie and watch the new season, they spoil the movie. <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah, because like the the movie in the that movie in the manga is a very important part in the fucking manga. It was a weird decision to make a very important part, just the whole movie. Oh, but that movie, so good. 
Oh, it's a good movie. Don't get oh me wrong. Oh my god, I hadn't cried. I've never cried. Like, if you asked me what a hero is, I wouldn't have been able to explain it to you. Oh my god! Before that movie. <laughs> Because before that movie, I thought a hero was like a cancer survivor or whatever. You know, like when someone. Oh, like, you meant you you meant a character. Oh, okay. yeah, yeah. I meant like the term. I was like, oh my god. <laughs> but now it's like, oh. Yeah, watch watch that movie for sure. I think I can fatal frame this butthead. Oh, I can use this spirit. This is, this is gonna hurt him, though. It didn't hurt him. Lately. Okay. I used my spirit energy on him and didn't do anything. I wanna try to get a. It sounds like a you problem. It, it sounds like a skill issue? Oh, there we go. Fatal yeah, frame. no. That's a skill issue. Uh, I just fatal framed him? Okay, so I get it. In hard mode, they do not give you the initial fatal frame. You have to you have to um do the initial fatal frame. You have to know when to when they're going to attack. Um Juan, yes. I like this one more than 5, but 5 has more refined systems, but I like this setting more. And I think that that's because just like a scary hospital is just inherently scary like there's nothing scarier than an abandoned hospital maybe maybe in an abandoned heart maybe that's a little scarier you know what i'm saying mark um just like uh that one game yep kingdom hearts just like kingdom yeah. hearts <laughs> Just like hearts. Kingdom Hearts. It all comes back to Kingdom Hearts. It all comes back to, uh, what, Quadratum. See? It all comes back to Quadratum. I know. Oh, here. Oh, I got you guys. Look at. See? These dolls. These fucking dolls. That's your ticket. That's your ticket to Bathing Suit <laughs> DLC. If you're trying, if you're trying to get sexy, if you're trying to get sexy. Just if you're trying. If you're trying to get sexy, get these dolls. Take a picture of them. You gotta get like 20 or 30 or something like that. I don't know how much. This is. Yeah. Um, but the. How much variety do you get? Well, you can't. The thing is, is you can't get like the Metroid outfit in this game, this version of the game. And I think that was in. Four. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah, they're trying to license out. The Switch yeah. or the Nintendo character. I mean, that Zero Suit, though. Ooh. Hot. Damn. Tamale. Hot tamale. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't know you had tamales on the East Coast. We have everything. Yeah. No, they, they do have tamales. You know what's it's cool? You know what's cool, guys? That. The fact that I can see her reflection in the mirror. You know how many freaking games... Don't allow you to see your reflection in the mirror? Bro, most main characters are vampires. That's why. <laughs> I hate that. Hate. Hate that. <laughs> you hate vampires, man? No, well, I hate vampires, but I also hate that I can't see my character in the mirror. Um, is, yeah, Moon Bear. Like, this, this, so this is the beginning yeah. of the game. But yes, you can... Um, Oh, Juan, there's way more backtracking in this one than in five. Well, five makes you run through the same areas, but here you have to go through it as three different protagonists. So you're going through the same areas as three different people. So I guess that sucks. Okay, so I have a special skill that lets me lock on to these bitches. So I don't have I don't have to move or anything. Oh, fuck. I fucked that up. I can't hear, so that's another problem. Is that you kind of have to listen for. Um, there's also a skill that lets you that puts an alarm on when it's like fatal frame time. But that was my shutter shot. I guess I collect spirit ghost energy. I thought I fatal framed her. That's embarrassing. 
But this is your friend, Madoka. You grew up with her. Bye, Greg. Have a good day. Or night. Yeah, see ya, Greg. I'm trying to fatal frame this. Oh, fuck, I didn't even see her. She scared me. <laughs> What's the actual objective of this game? Um, walk around in bathing suits and hunt ghosts. You hunt what? Dude, you just take pictures of I mean, ghosts? I, you want me to, you want me to actually tell you <laughs> the story? I don't, no, I don't, I'm not gonna ruin, I won't, I would never ruin the story, but it's, it's dumb. <laughs> it's so dumb. It's good. What does that mean? Uh, it means it's good, right? Yeah, it means it's like... I don't know, it's fun. <laughs> it's, uh, Zario good is the opposite of good. <laughs> it's fun. I gotta go to the bathroom. I'll be back. Uh, there he goes. There he goes. The stream takeover. Yeah. So, um, we're gonna we're gonna the seals have been broken. Out, like a bunch of noisy pickle secrets right now. Jesus. Right now. We'll we'll give you the inside loop, we'll tell you which one of us Azario hates. Hey <laughs> My God. Uh cause ghosts come out at night, and that's usually the reason there, Brian. Unfortunately. <laughs> uh, in also, fact, I think all, all these games come out at uh, work at night. <laughs> I mean, yeah, that isn't wrong per se. What do you mean I'm not? I'm not wrong per se. I'm right. Are you right? Yeah. Yeah. I'm always right. <laughs> What did I tell you today, Ryuji? What did I tell you about the thumbnail? I was like, do it in red. And what did you do? You did it in red. And how does it look? How did it look? Okay, okay, okay. How does it look? I mean, the audience needs to, to truly decide that. <laughs> oh. oh, wow. Oh. Ryuji calling me out right now? <laughs> if I like it and the audience doesn't like it, well then. Is Ryuji trying to fight wow. people again? Ryuji yeah, is above yeah, all. Go fight. Ryuji is above the normal. I'm flying to Brazil tomorrow, man. Right, oh, I asked Ryuji yeah. to teach me how to fight. Right, I asked Ryuji to teach me how to fight. Ryuji can train us? You did not. Stop, Stop lying to the people, are you, please? <laughs> So there's there's three protagonists in this game. That was Yuka. And this is um I forgot her name. I forgot her name. There are there are three protagonists. And this is I forgot it's her like name. Like Misaki or something? Wow. I don't know. Excited for any games this year. Uh I'm a little excited for Resident Evil 4. I'm a little excited for... Um... I don't know. What games are coming out this year? You guys want to do a yay or nay? Oh my god. You, you forgot the Tears of the Ooh. Kingdom? Let's do a little... Yeah, off, let's do a little... Kingdom. A little live yay or nay. We're taking, we're taking Spencer's spot. Yeah, 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 or nay. Yeah, 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 or nay. Um. All right. Um. Time. I'm, I'm going through the list. We have Tales to Azure. Are we excited about that game? Uh, I am. <laughs> Bailey's not though. I know he's not. <laughs> yeah, he might not be. I am about to plot it though. He um, is about to plot it. Starfield. Yeah. I am. 
Starfield's my fucking name, bro. Dude, Brian, can I start? Can I? Okay, so as someone, as someone who's played Steins Gate, as someone who gave Steins Gate Zero a nine out of ten, which it <laughs> rightfully deserved. Oh boy, here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. Can, can I jump rabbit. right into anonymous code? Yes, you can. <laughs> okay. Well, like, you're gonna miss out on, like, context, but... Yeah, you'll be able to, like, understand... Because, like, it's like... It's like a... Insane... <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Here we go. There's a lot of There's just saying... God damn. God. Like, like, every single mainline science adventure game... Oh! I was right. Need, Her name is Misaki. It, it, they don't. They don't ever need um. They don't ever need prior prior context. They're really not like trails. They're they are not like trails. Yeah. They are not like trails. Yeah. At all. Well, kind of like. Oh, this trails thing has this. It has kind of you guys. With, it has jiggle what? physics. Oh gosh. Don't. This is a, if you're a worried. I should have get. I should have. I knew I should have given it an eight out of ten. Point <laughs> five it needed. <laughs> that was the point five. <laughs> imagine, imagine if like eight out of ten, and then the the little caption at the end say says jiggle physics. Must I say any more? I uh Brian, I used to write for uh, Dual Shockers, and I was I reviewed Steins Gate Zero for Dual Shockers. So look it up. That's a little Azaria lore for you. Yeah, lore. Uh, Stellar Blade. I thought that is that game in early access right now. No, no. It's coming to PS Five sometime though. Yeah, yeah. Is it on? Is it? Really is, is it out? No, it's not. No. Oh. No, not even close. To I am. I am very it's excited for that though. Looks. Looks. Yeah. Looks really good. Yeah, it looks really fucking good. Uh, I'm surprised no one said FF16. I, I, well, that's kind of like the the brain dead. Everybody's probably excited for FF16 in some way, shape, or form. You sure about that? Yeah, bro. Like, just because you don't like the game, you're gonna be excited to, to see it fail. So that's what you want. <laughs> I'm probably, oh, yeah, I'm excited to see it fail. I forgot. I I keep forgetting about um FF sixteen. Oh yeah, Zelda. Zelda Breath of the Wild two. Yeah, yeah. Tears of the Kingdom, baby. Um. Tears of the Kingdom. Did you ever beat Breath of the Wild? The Kingdom. I would like to see. Yeah. I think Mark should review that game. What Tears of the Kingdom? Yeah. <laughs> There's no Mario here. Where's Mario? Mario. Mario. I'm trying to. Oh right, because it's because it, like once midnight hits, we'll be on March 10th. It's Mario Day. That's a. Yeah. That's why. You guys see? There's Mario an, Day. There's an item here, and I don't know what. Oh, oh, look it. See, I tell you, they try to hide from me, <laughs> but they can't hide for long. Curse doll. That's number two. Hey, Victor. Oh, yeah. Victor's here, Mark. Victor? Not cool Victor. <laughs> Not your Victor. Victor, Victor. <laughs> I'm trying to look for this item, and I can't find it. I s you know how what? You if gonna, I sh How are you going to take that, Victor? <laughs> if I strafe, usually the item shows up. You know what? Maybe I think it's just showing me the panel board. To be honest with you, probably. Yeah. With anger, <laughs> angry Victor is here. <laughs> <laughs> Victor, we're going to Boston later without you. It's not. Only we're not gonna have a rat in our Airbnb. Not good. Airbnb this time. Yeah, we're not gonna have a rat. <laughs> Everybody in the chat, let me tell you, Noisy Pixel hasn't always been this noisy. Pixel. <laughs> noisy Pixel. <laughs> one time, one one uh Boston trip, uh we um we had a uh, room, but the room was uh 
was simply um, all beds. It was rooming. It was all beds. It was all created. Uh, like it was one room about this size, about the size of my room right now. Um, and um, all beds. And it was just beds, like a, an aisle, and then it had beds propped up. And um, six boys. Six boys were in that uh, room. Um, to me, it was a dream come true. <laughs> uh, to Mark? Actually, everyone was really cool about it. Did you feel that way too, Mark? Yeah, I don't think anyone... No one cared. Had a bad time. No, we weren't, we weren't there to sit in that room anyway. <laughs> yeah, we, we spent very little time in the room. The there, room. there was a there was a, a mouse though. Oh no! And it okay. came out periodically. <laughs> yeah. did, you, did you hang out with the mouse? <laughs> no, he did. I don't think he liked us very much. Uh, <laughs> I remember. I remember the we had another writer named Leaf, who got kind of upset uh, that. <laughs> That I uh, brought people nose strips because <laughs> I didn't want to hear them snore. <laughs> oh, I'm, sorry, huh? I'm that guy, dude. Oh, you're that guy. <clears throat> I can't sleep if there's snoring going on. Um, yeah, you got kind of offended and felt bad. Did you? Yeah, I think he, he took it me. off. I think he he pretended to put it on one night and he took it off. I was like, okay, dude, that's fine. No. Okay. <laughs> Bailey. Oh, I gave Bailey. Leaf the. <laughs> no. Oh, fuck. Uh, Leaf Leaf got the nose strip too, but I think you got the nose strip as well. No. Me? No, Victor. Oh. Um. <laughs> Give him the nose strips. I know what I have to do. I have to look for this code. I wish I just saved it. TBH. Ryuji, you want to find me that code? Uh, Ryuji, you want to cheat? Ryuji, cheat for me. Find what code? <clears throat> Never mind. Get on this code. Never mind. Uh, how is Zario doing? And I'll just do it. Make a Zario do it. It's worked out for me before, man. Zario will do it. Nothing in this room. Did everybody oh. did everybody have dinner tonight? Everyone in the chat? Is there if you're in the chat, let me know what you had for Okay. I found I like what do you, you need it now, I'm sorry, because I got it. Is it sixty nine sixty nine four twenty? No. Mm. Unfortunately not. Where's the number pad? If it's not 69, 69, 420, then we don't want anything to do with it. <laughs> I don't even want to hear the code anymore. Hey, Jackie Jan. How are you? Jackie Jam. No, Jan. 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 Mm. We're just we're just gonna proceed in talking with hoons now. It's up, <laughs> Ryuji. How we go, bro? Man. I know what I'm supposed It'll to be do. A long I probably already. I probably already. It's gonna be a long night. 
Yeah, it'll be a Why? long night. Why? Bro, I don't sleep. Oh, maybe? No, not maybe that I one. Oh, it keeps... Okay, so... So it keeps all your codes, I guess. Um, even from the... Uh, from the previous game, if you do... Um, New Game Plus. New Game Plus. That's kind of cool. So what was yeah. the code supposed to do? Well, I, I, I can find it, I guess, but... I know the code. I just found it. Like, I just What's the code? It. Tell me the code. Tell me the code, Ryuji. All right, then. I will tell you. Where's the num what's where where's the number pad? You need to go there first. Okay, I'll go to the number pad. I'm so excited. So the number pad. Can you do it in Morse code? Oh wait, hold on. You guys didn't see it? There's that little bitch right there. Boom! Blah, blah. Curse doll found. Clack clack clack. Clack clack. Bing bong. <laughs> How many does that make? <laughs> Tell me how you feel about Joe Biden. Big bog. Oh my god. Oh my god. Drop <laughs> in chat. It's like I said, it's gonna be a long night. It's gonna be a long night. Hey, buddy. Oh my god, hey, Ryuji, I'm so sorry. They're blocking me from the... I, ha I have to go back. They're blocking me from the shortcut. Because of powerful uh, force. You know those powerful forces that just keep you from things? Yeah, yeah. that's called anxiety as well. <laughs> <laughs> it's called the workforce. <laughs> Called fucking capitalism, bro. <laughs> those, go I love this <laughs> those goddamn powerful boys. Oh fuck. Well, yeah, buddy. I guess. I guess nothing. It never hurts to have another drink, right, Mark? Sometimes it does. Sometimes it does. <laughs> Sometimes it does. Sometimes. It do be hurting. It do be hurting. I think I'm, I'm getting a little white claw wasted. <laughs> oh, I, I feel like that's like drinking water and alcohol. I mean, kind of. I'm being a college girl, laser cat, and... Who do you think you are? I am. Oh. What happened, okay, Mark? That makes... <laughs> Who do you think you are? I am. Who do you think you are? I am. No, who do you think you are? I am. Oh, who I think I am? You are? What the fuck's going on? <laughs> I, I don't fucking know, dude. I think I'm having a stroke and an aneurysm on one. Who do you think you are? I am. Okay, so whoever I think I am, that's who you are. <laughs> you are? <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah. White Claw. But. Yeah. But I'm an intellectual, so I put it in a glass. I'm not. I'm not sponsoring Ew. them. Wow! Who drinks white claw out of a glass? Me. White claw. Exactly. Sponsor us white. They're, not, they're actually not that terrible. If there's nothing else. Like I'm not gonna like pay for that like an alcohol, a white claw at the bar. But like if there's a white claw near me, I'll be like, yo, can I get that white claw? <laughs> <laughs> Do you add an or else? Do you add an or else behind there? Or else? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Can I get that white claw? Uh, or else? Yeah, or else. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hit me with that white claw. <laughs> or else. Okay, you ready, Ryuji, with the code? The code, the code is well. Oh code. wait, I can't. I can't actually enter the code without finding the code. Uh, yeah. Gosh darn it. Oh. Oh. My. God. How is Mario doing? Gosh darn it. I thought it was over here, to be honest. But this door is locked. Maybe it's over here. 
Maybe it's not down maybe the stairs. Maybe. Maybe, maybe it was in our hearts all along. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe friendship was the ghost all along. Maybe friendship. You know what? Nope. Maybe gravity. That's locked too. You know, the funny thing is, is that she, like, went to these, like, she followed those little ghosts down to the right there. She went, yeah, dude, so when you get lost in this game, good luck. Good luck, indeed. Unless you crack open a guide. Yeah, tell me where to find... I have... They don't have a, they don't have a map in this game? Uh, they do. Find the, the coat. Map? Oh, here's the map. <laughs> here's the map. It doesn't really help. Interesting. The oh. map has the has the kanji for north, south, east, west, like written on it. Oh, goo. Uh, Ryuji. Fun fact. Bam, bam, bam. With another Ryuji fun facts coming in. Yeah, they're coming in hot. Wait, okay, you so I, I couldn't open stop. the door that direction, but I can open the door this direction? How does that make sense? Video game logic, that's what. Uh, you're right, it is video game logic. That's Sometimes video games have logic that, that even us won't understand. Well, maybe the developer, but, you know. That's besides the point. I swear, I've beat this game. <laughs> I the more you say it, the less I believe you. I yeah. <clears throat> I had I, I had to have picked up that file before, so I know the code. So why don't they let me just put in the code? If I go through all my files, I'll find it. Bro, because it was in a past life. Oh, I. Well, and I, and I think me and Nate, I don't know if Nate's probably thinking the same thing as me. If I had to guess, it's because Azar hasn't, like, raised the flag to happen yet. Right, Nate? Yeah, yeah there's probably is, something I have happened. to do. Um, yeah, like, the game, you might have the code, but the game doesn't know you have it. So I have to tell the game that uh -huh. I know the code. What is it? Uh-huh. How you gonna do that, boy? How you gonna do that? Well, I did interview the director of this game. <clears throat> game don't give a shit. Oh my <clears throat> god, you're not... You're not <laughs> I did interview the director. So. Eh. Maybe I'll just send him a message telling him that I know the code. I'm, I'm getting yeah, really yeah. distracted by her butt, too, so there's that. Um, and now everyone's looking Classic at us. Classic Zario. Classic Zario. Um, okay, so there's nothing up here. Cool. There was no reason for me to go up here. Unless. Secret. Ooh. Nothing. Uh oh, my cat screaming at me. Did you feed him? Uh, no, he wants to go outside. I mean, he wants to go outside my room. Yeah, 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 yeah. But he had his one shot, and he already missed his opportunity. He let it slip by. Yeah, he has to wait till I have to pee again, so I'll drink some more. Yeah, man. Done. He like you gotta get drug tested. <laughs> you guys, I'm so sorry. I don't know what the hell. Okay, so that's the, okay. I don't need to go there. Uh. Okay, fuck it. I have the file. Max bucket? Um, back information, information about lift. Mm. No, I'm more of a Uber guy. Hmm. 
Oh yeah, my paycheck came through just now, boys. Who's not getting evicted? Who's not oh getting evicted? God. This boy. This. Oh, this stream just got so heavy. Dear Lord. Blossoming. Okay, that's. Dear Lord. Uh -huh. Ryuji, help me out. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> my name. I'm. Oh wait, that's that's like a huge. I can't. I can't read that. That's like a. The problem is, like, are you okay with spoiling people? That's. The I just want to know how to where. Okay, so I got that memo with the code. Okay, so that's not something I need. No, that's not. I already stopped the, I already stopped the memo with the codes. Yeah, but it's not that one. That's. That's uh. Yeah, that is different. That's a different code. Maybe they mm -hmm. they took it from me. Cause it should have been right above that. I I got that little picture. Oh. Hmm. I swear, if it's like that item that's like blue in that room. That I thought was the switchboard. There's not that many doors here. But we're going back. It really is. This is half yeah, the back fun. With half. It is half, half the fun. Honestly, backtracking is like the staple of like old survival horror games. Yeah, like when you're um. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> Think about it. You got Resident Evil, Silent <laughs> Hill, Alone in the Dark. Any one of those. I know. I know. Okay. So I I searched it. Uh huh. And apparently, and apparently to like answer the combination, there should be a grandfather clock. Oh, the clock! It's right here. I can't hear. That's the problem. How is hearing gonna help you? With because that? the clock is probably going off right now, and I can't, I can't actually hear it. But the people have you been? Have you been as games are you? Well, I could hear the clock chiming. Well, like when do you Sorry, recall? I can't read this. I can't hear. Eighty three ninety five. <laughs> yeah, if you can't hear, good luck. Thanks now for we know. thanks for you, G. And and those little girls, the little girl ghosts, they mm -hmm. gave me the clock. Right. Okay. Oh fuck. Kind of scary. All right. So the adventure continues. Ry Ryuji's the code master. Eight three nine five. Okay, so now we can go to the girls' rooms. Yay! The the blue. You guys might have noticed that the 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 kanji's on the red then. <laughs> and blue buttons look similar but there's just one little trace that is different what's that red means it's the the first one the fir like the red one is closed and then the and the blue one is open let me up let me up i need to draw to explain kan kanji radical radicals at this point uh, i i never learned fucking radicals you should, honestly. Radicals are such like they help more, more than more than you think. Pay attention to your radicals. He's probably right. I probably should. Demo Akamagawarui. Ah, fuck. <laughs> She's so fast. <laughs> 
<laughs> I want to. I want to get a fatal frame. That's like my favorite thing to do. I'll die. I'll die for the fatal frame. Live for the fatal frame. Die. For Oh my god. There's a time there's a timing, I swear. I'll get it. I promise. So she has a lot of she has a lot of uh I bought her a lot of film and stuff because there's um there's a boss at the end of the game that's like really hard. So she's like stocked up on like the strongest film. Sorry I had to stack the deck. Oh it's it's this is a pretty hard game. Cute nurse girl. <laughs> Cute nurse ghost. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, I, I am almost certain there's somebody who wants to screw that nurse. If there's people who want to screw the nurse monsters from Silent Hill, that's somebody's jam. Easy. <laughs> um, so, okay, so sometimes I'll tell you guys, like, it doesn't explain this to you. But there's secret curses that you can find with that blue uh, light. And you kind of just have to follow it and see how the reticle is blue right here, but it's yellow right here. So if I ever see the blue um, kind of arrow right there, like if I, if I face this way, it'll tell me to my right or whatever. And it doesn't tell you this like straight out, but these are like secret curses that you can find. And they also um, add to your unlockables. So, woman hanging herself, I guess. Curse. And you get points. Um, but yeah, it's... Um, so there's there's hidden stuff. There's you, you, have, you actually have to replay this game, too, um, to get the true <laughs> ending. Um, the normal ending kind of sucks. You you want the true ending, because you have to you, you like you like beg for answers, at the end of this game. So the only way to get the true ending too is to um, beat the game on hard. And is there any reason why you have to do it in two? Like is hard mode locked behind normal? No no you just... can play hard from the beginning, but you won't have your camera upgraded or anything, so it will be really hard. Hey Lozi, I'm um. I'm Spencer's co-host from the Spencer show. Um, Spencer can't be here tonight. Too busy hanging out. Look at look at it. Look at, look at this little bitch. Boom. First. That's number four, guys. That's number four. We're gonna get that bathing suit DLC, I'll tell you what. <clears throat> The bathing suit that you unlock in this game, yeah. way better than this one. I'll tell you, Whew. it's that H A W T hot. The one that you uh, you have to dim the lights for. I don't believe you. I'll choose to believe you, but I don't think I believe you. <laughs> Okay, so the alarm upgrade for um, for Misaki is really cool because an alarm goes off. You hear the 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 alarm go off when a fatal frame is about to occur, and I don't think Yuka gets this. Um. So. Yeah, it's it's a it's a super good upgrade anytime you get upgrades they automatically equip but you can unequip them if you if you want man this is this is 70 dollars for the deluxe edition um yeah i don't know what it actually comes with uh the digital deluxe edition comes with the art book the digital mm. the costume set and the marie rose outfit hmm mm. no marie rose i think unlocks if you pre-ordered the game. Yeah. Oh, is it? Yeah. Well, I don't yep. know why it's telling me that, it, that it's in the... 
it's, it's, oh, it's, 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 uh, hasn't switched the listing oh. over yet. You're right. God damn ghosts. Game. I'm really excited Ooh, for I fatal framed her. Oh, fuck. It feels so good. Sorry. What are you excited for? Well, I'm excited for that Eternite scene, dude. That's pretty good. It looks really good. We're gonna finally have that game of Among Us for it. Oh, fatal frame. Double fatal frame all the way across the sky. Double fatal frame all across the sky. Yeah. Does it, so this girl goes down and then up. This is like the one that I suck at. Oh fuck! Oh, I fucking fucked that up. Oh, it's okay. Give me some more time. Thank you. All you, all we all needed was just a little more time. Oh. Double rainbow. Didn't get it. Damn it. I also go down and then up. <laughs> and then down. And then. <laughs> I'm gonna equip some stronger film. <laughs> and then back down. <laughs> All right, guys. I know it's sad. But I gotta go. Oh, I was fine. gonna say, don't you fucking dare. Don't you dare. God, don't you fucking dare hit that disconnect button. Oh my god, her little belly dancing freaking dude. Do it. I will quit Noise Pixel. He's gone, dude. If you leave this That's... chat. Dude, he's oh. gone. I still he's gonna you. Me, Dylan. I, <laughs> you, <laughs> I, I expect your recognition on my desk tomorrow morning. On your desk. <laughs> Hey, I know where that yes, mirror sir. is. We're going to the right, library. See, night, that's what I'm saying. Night, back guys. and forth, we're going back so. to the library. Back and forth. Back and forth. Back. Okay, I gotta let my cat out. You wanna make a one hit wonder dance song for weddings? It's called Back and Forth. That's not a one hit wonder. It will it will be when we make it. That, be the oh, new, we're uh, we're writing this song. Yeah, like instead of you know how like slide to the left, it'll oh, be like one of those songs. You want you want to make back and forth, back back and forth, <laughs> back and forth, back back and forth. I think you already wrote it though. And there we go. Now we just got to produce it. I can and, make the music uh, to it. We're gonna call it a day. Hey, Johnny Q. Ah, oh, dude. I can't stop talking about that game, but like talking about the characters and their relationships is already spoiling it. Like the writing for Paranormal Site is fucking so good. Um, so damn good, dude. Just it's in and, and the fact that it's like it's an eight to ten hour game, you know. But the fact that you like, it's only like twenty bucks. Is also kind of cool. I I wonder how the mobile version is. Um. But yeah, honestly, uh, that that was such a surprise, especially because Square Enix doesn't know how to market it. <clears throat> Let me see if I can get Halo Frame this bitch. Got him. Got him again. Got him again. No, I didn't get them that last time. He was behind the bookcase. You gonna hide behind that bookcase, sir? Oh, fuck. Mark, are you scared? I'm exactly watching, but... I'm pretty scared. I'm pretty scared. Of life in general. Nope. If anything, I've been uh, oh my less God. scared than ever about life. I like that. You know what I hate when people say? When they say, I love that for you. Like, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? You love it for me? What about for you? That means they look down on what you're doing. That's what I'm thinking. It's like saying, well, it's good for what you like to do. 
Yeah, they don't see the power yet. <laughs> it's good for what I like to do. What the hell does that mean? It's like, all right, clearly we ain't going out on a date. <laughs> I think uh, I think you manifested that <laughs> hypothetical. <laughs> I guess you don't oh, love yeah. me. <laughs> Guess we're not getting married. <laughs> hey, I can Clearly, see the she doesn't respect what I'm doing. You know what I'm saying? I can see the ghost in the uh, in the. Oh, uh, you can see it in the uh, mirror over there. Uh, I thought I could. Uh oh. <laughs> um. Um, there's a few there's a few scenes that just freak me out um in paranormal um, site and I can't wait for more people to experience him <laughs> are you talking about are you talking about me wearing anything like I'm wearing <laughs> I'm wearing like a salmon sweater <laughs> or like I'm wearing a belly dancer outfit in this game and hunting ghosts Oh, I'm trapped. Um. Oh, so this is a this is like a big part of the game. These mask fragments, um, very important. It has it. It it has to do with actually the whole entire game. To be honest with you, um. At least the story, as, as far as the story goes. Kind of exciting. Oh, I love how you just wear anything. <laughs> yeah, my, I, that for you. my one of my colleagues the other day said, um, you're so unapologetically a Zario. And I was like, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? <laughs> Not afraid to be you. <laughs> Am I supposed to be? <laughs> There's some underhanded compliments that can be taken. I'm sure it was a compliment, but it can be taken either way. I love that for you. Well, do you love? Yeah, I love that for you. <laughs> do you love what I'm doing? You love it for me. <laughs> I love that for you. You're doing a great job. You're doing a really good job. I hope you succeed in that one day. Oh, okay. There's a, there's a photo mode in this game. I forgot, how to, I forgot how to get to it. But you can get to it. I promise. With the digital edition, I think you get a... An, um, I think you get a, um, a gallery or a art book or something in the game. So, um, maybe I'll show, maybe I'll show that at the end of the stream. And we can see just how real, these, real is. how real these ghosts get. Um, all the assets of like the the notes and and stuff have been redone. Who do you think you are? I am. Whoever you think you are, I am. You know what that's from? No. It's Fast and the Furious <laughs> Three. No, it's just I don't remember the guy's name, but it's some like professional bowler. He like rips a strike and then he's like, "Yeah, oh, who do you think you are? I am." Oh my God. <laughs> Dude, <it's so> funny. <laughs> but yeah, it's like the higher pitched voice. He just gets so amped up. That's Madoka. Dude, it was so funny. I'll never forget it. Is it just us in the in the chat now, Mark? 
It's me. I'm here. Uh, Ryuji's here, but I'm here too. Does he? Is Johnny he Q, thank you so much. That does mean a lot to us, especially the little bird emoji doing the fist pops. Oh my god. Uh, bird emoji. Oh my bird god. Bird emoji. Todd B is still here. Bird. Todd B, I can feel your presence, so you don't even have to tell me that you're here because, like, to me, you're always right here on my lap. <laughs> <laughs> very comfy um victor i don't cycle i run from my problems <laughs> no i run i do run i ran today um, just for 15 minutes though but i did go i did go to the gym um um I used to cycle a lot in college. It's a little cycle, a um, little cycler. Used to ride a fixed gear. Um. <laughs> it's, oh yeah! Oh, I can't believe you heard that. <laughs> what happened? With he, his knows, he knows. He knows. <laughs> <laughs> What? I tried to keep my girlfriend a uh, secret from Todd B for too long. <laughs> How did the uh, what did you do in the chin? Uh, I think I said it like right at the end. <laughs> I'm gonna go here, yeah, by the way. <laughs> by the way, I'm a girlfriend. <laughs> I'm sorry, Todd. <laughs> I'm sorry, Todd. <laughs> Forgive me, Father. Yeah, she doesn't know Simpsons references. Dude. I literally I literally leave for for like a few seconds to go get water and then I, I come back to Azario like laughing, crying. I'm trying what to find an item right now, because this is blue. So there's definitely an item around here. God, this is why I hate this game. Where could it be? You have to sh Sometimes when I Wait. strafe, it works. It works better when I strafe. Wait. Maybe this it's is in the slight. Oh. Is it in the No. No. Is it, in is it No. Uh, let me see. Let me see. No, here. it's not gonna. I I doubt it's gonna say it in the walkthrough. And it's probably. I mean. Oh, it's in. There's nothing there. Wait. I've never seen this. This is new. Uh, the the doubt that you beat in this game grows by the minute. It does. Wow, I've never seen that. <gasps> Spooky, sorry Brian. That was a little scary scene. <laughs> it's okay. Cause after the stream, I'll tuck in each and every one of you. Give you a get a little sweet next to your bed. Give you a little kiss on the forehead. Except for you, Mark. You get a kiss on the lips. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I'm thinking about drinking caffeinated beverages right now. It's eleven o'clock. What do you think? What do you think? <clears throat> it's eleven o'clock on the dot. In my drop top, cruising the streets. Oh, in the drop top. Dude, that girl's getting her. That sexy nurse is getting fucking dragged by that little bitch. I watched that in the first person. Sexy nurse. Sexy nurse. Getting dragged by the little bit. <laughs> oh, I just opened the door. My favorite part. Black. Oh, oh, I know Black. exactly where I am. This part's really hard, but really cool cutscene. I will say, I'm not gonna skip but. this one because it is a really good cutscene. I do think this game is pretty. But. Um. 
I do think this is a pretty game. <clears throat> I think that girl's creepy. I think my outfit is really cute. But B U T T. <gasps> she jumped on my back. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Get off of me. You jerk. You little jerk. <laughs> Look what you did, you little, <laughs> did little, you little jerk. jerk. Fuck. This stupid Dude, this girl's really hard. I promise you she Oh. Look what you did, you little jerk. I'm not gonna use my type 90. I'll use my type 45s on her. She like, dude, watch. I'm gonna fatal frame her ass, and she's just gonna smile at me afterwards. It's the creepiest fucking thing. She's gonna disappear. She's gonna, you gonna fatal frame her. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. Watch her smile. Oh my god, she is so scary. A mule with a spinning wheel. Am I supposed to know what that means? What is it? <laughs> the stream is like a mule with a spinning wheel. Todd B has... I'm too slow for this. Dude, it's just Todd B, man. Let him talk. Let the man... I am. Let the man... I didn't stop it. I didn't delete it. Let the man it. use his words. I'll delete it right now. You're... Oh my god. Oh my god. He yelled out, die? Has anyone had a paranormal experience here? Dude, Lozy? Dude, sit back. Tuck, dude, sit back, grab, grab, a, grab a glass of cocoa. Because I got a story for you. <clears throat> so I was, I was once, I was once young. And um, I was, I was laying, I was laying on, I was sleeping. Um, but it was in my living room on the couch. And what my brother, and I used to do is he would sleep on his head on one end and my head on another. And, um, and one night I, 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 it was like 3 a.m. I must have woken up. I'm like 11 years old, 12 years old right now. And, and I hear like a laughing from behind the, 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 the cushion, the, the board of the couch. And I hear a laughing. And my brother's name is Armani. My name's Azaria. Um, and I remember, like, like, whispering, Armani. And I couldn't move, okay? So I know what you're going to say. Oh, the paralyzed sleep. Yeah, I, I was sleep paralysis. Yeah, I get it. It is sleep paralysis. I get it. That's what I'm explaining right now. But irregardless, um, so I see this from behind me. From above me, like like I'm laying down, and above me, this black like circle comes up, and then just sinks into my my chest, just really fast, comes into my chest, and I and I and then I can move again. But before I couldn't move, um, I couldn't move, and uh uh, I finally like jerked up, and then um later later on, later on I um. I realized that um, in some cultures, they believe that sleep paralysis is when a um, virgin ghost is having sex with you. So I got face fucked by a ghost. That's the end of my story, but it is a true story. Sleep paralysis sucks. If anyone's ever had it, have you ever had that mark? Nope, I don't think so. It's okay, I'll give it to you in Boston. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> God. Oh, can I, I, I gave, uh, Chu, I can't say, I know I can't, it, Cho, Choshiro, I gave him his, uh, swimwear outfit too. So, oh, look at that chest. He's a detective. Ooh. Um, he's the third pro tag. And he, and he doesn't have a, um, he doesn't have a camera.
Yeah, Mr. Uh, Bin X Kitty. Can I call you Mr. Bin? Um, yeah, that, that ghost, that little girl ghost, you have to fight her again, and she sucks. Choshiro. I mean, for him to get those chiseled abs, I want to let you know how hard that is. Oh, so he um he has a flashlight. Not that cool. Not as cool as a camera. But it makes the game feel a little more like a um, first-person shooter. I feel. Got his chancla song. Bailey, I can hear your scroll wheel from a mile away. <laughs> just <laughs> scroll, just scroll, just hacking, just hacking away. Bailey's always hacking. I'm so mad. Oh, the trails for Azure is glitched. I can't scan an enemy. I can't get the achievement. Dude, that's that's not okay. Nisa, I have to write an article. Yo, I'm gonna write an article right now. They thought so they mad. thought they thought no one was gonna get that. They thought no one was gonna get that. I'm so mad. That's the last enemy I fucking need. Oh my god. Oh. Um Trishiro's more like a first person shooter. <laughs> Is that the will of the mule? <laughs> um, but the thing, the thing that sucks about Choshiro is that you have to um, not be in first person mode to charge the flashlight. Um, fun fact, no secret. Sayaka said they must have already blossomed. Yikes, Toshiro. How did you say her name? Sayaka? Oh my god. How would you say it? Sayaka. Ugh. Ugh. Oh my god, Azaria. Your pronunciation. Yeah, like, <laughs> like, what? I'm what, Ryuji? Not... What are you gonna say? Ryuji's perfect. Ryuji, Ryuji's are you perfect. good? Are you good? Ryuji, really? You wanna go there right now? <laughs> I'm just gonna say that Bailey's right. <laughs> I am right. I am right. Maybe I'm right. Right. Is it Asuka right. or is it Asuka? No one uh, says Asuka. Who the fuck says that? No one says that. Who says Asuka? Only you say that. Gaijin boy. Who? I. I'm a Gaijin boy. I'm a Gaijin boy. Okay. I'm a Gaijin. I don't think that card applies here, Azario. Oh, I can buy lenses. The card? Thoughts on the new Atele. I pre-ordered the collectors from yeah. NIS. <laughs> I hope it's good. Um, it's gonna probably be good. Are we talking? Are we talking Ryza? Yeah. I think yeah. I'm the yeah. only one that's played that so far, right? It must be in Ryza. I was already freaking bragging, bro. <laughs> Got them thighs in my face. Got the thighs in my face. Get that. Raza, yeah, There's a mini game in Ryza 3 where she crushes a watermelon between. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh my god. The thing. That'd be pretty hot. <laughs> whenever, whenever we talk about Ryza, I remember about the like relationship chart that I got one of the relations wrong. I'm pre-ordering it. Yeah, the if you pre-order Rise of Three, you get the water, the watermelon crushing mini game. <laughs> uh, so I like it. Um, coming from S Sophie Two, Sophie Two is super good. Um, I don't think I don't think it's taught. You played Sophie Two, right, uh, Bailey? Yeah. Um there's some there's some really good story moments in Sophie 2 um that I think show 
just how like dynamic the narrative can be in these in these stories how deep they can go um with like just like i don't know like the story of her grandma like because you hear a lot about her grandma in the first one and you visit her grave a couple times um so it is kind of cool um <laughs> what well, if to respond to someone <laughs> um so uh yeah so sophie too the battle system was fun and um kind of like the turn-based system was fun um but rise of three kind of throws all that away and and it's more of a an action oriented battle system um but it's really fast it's like it's like they want you to um, to just search through shit, you know. I don't know. Like you, you encounter an enemy, but if all the enemies are in the field, so if there's three enemies in the area, you fight all. You, if you run into one, you fight all three of them. Um, kind of interesting. Um, it's not just you. You run into one and then the other three are just hanging out there when you come out of that battle. Um, I guess that's more of like what you would expect, you know? <laughs> it's like there's three enemies there. There's three enemies that you're going to fight, but our our gamer brains are like, oh, that's three different groups of enemies. <clears throat> um, so it's a lot faster, right? It's a three. It's very big. Everything is connected. Um, like their hearts, just like their friendship. Um, it's pretty too. Very pretty game. Um, I'll tell you guys what Cho Choshiro is here for. Um, he's here to find this uh, kidnapper guy who kidnaps little girls. It's it's, <laughs> it's really pretty heavy. <clears throat> if it were up to me, I would bring Mana Kamiya as a kind of sub saga with more action and let those who are called to tell you I continue in turn base. Yeah. I don't know why they don't. And I can only, I can only say, Oh, look at this little bitch right here. Oh my God. So the pro okay. So another problem with this dude is that you have to equip, um, a special lens to take pictures. Um, yeah, I liked, I liked the mana series of, um, the Atelier spinoffs. I, I thought the, I only played the first two. Is there only two? I played the one on PSP. Um, and I played the one on PS2. It's, it's good. Um, but I doubt they'll ever go back because, like, I don't even know when we're ever going to get a new male protagonist in those games. Probably never. Um, yeah, it's, it's, Logi was really good, too. You know what, I just, was, yeah. I just think if they, like, yeah. make that, um, <clears throat> I don't know, if they take a chance on, like, relationship between the protagonists because right now there's like I don't know there's there's a little bit of lesbian stuff going on with Risa but if they this, you know, like I, I feel like people always say that but there, it's not really I don't know they like slept together and stuff haven't they have they, have they? I think so <laughs> maybe I just what? made that up <laughs> what <laughs> Maybe that's like when I was a kid and I told people that there's a nude code in Mortal Kombat 2. Oh my god. There's not a room. There's not a nude. I'm just, I'm on the Arts Nelico, um, um, Copium right now. I've been on the Copium for like five years. You want more Art and Art Nelico? 
How did you say? I say, I call I call it Artone Lico. Shut no you no you don't. What don't, do you call it? call it? What do you call it? There's no one here. I don't know anyone that plays these games. <laughs> is that what? No, is that, who says it like that? No one says it. Like that. I'm from California, bro. <laughs> that, do, that doesn't matter. California. <laughs> oh my god. California is a place with the homeless. <laughs> California. Yeah, that's a real song. I'm caught it. California. I'm caught it. I I do. I do like. Um... So, in terms of like the opening of Rites of Three, from which I've played and which I can talk about, no. I do like it. It's very big. Very, very big. It's really nostalgic, too, kind of, because they let you um, go back. Because her, her home is there, right? Yeah, you go back yeah. through the home island and kind of comparing it to the first game, where it was like sectioned off, you know, and now it's all connected. Mm -hmm. Kind of cool. I'm a Ghostbuster. I'm really writing up this oracle about the, the dumb glitch. The what? <laughs> the the fucking glitch I just had in Trail Sad. You're so mad right now. You're blogging as a news article. <laughs> Yes, I uh, totally, totally totally unplayable. Catch it. Unplayable. Totally catch it. unplayable. I'm trying to get all the achievements, Nisa. I'm trying to get all the achievements right now. Blog, blog, blog. I beat the game on Nightmare today, bro. I thought I was going to get all the achievements tonight. That the game been... glitch, and now we can't finish. You know, the game? there's a there's a um a glitch in um or there's a, there's a part in Neptunia, the first one, to get the platinum where you have to complete the full beastery. But there's like these two enemies that are really hard to spawn, and I hated that. Ah, oh, Johnny Q, thank you so much. Well, thank you, Johnny. Johnny, who's Johnny? Johnny Q. Mark is so happy that you're here right now. He's going to be talking about this night. Yeah, we got a super sticker? How long does that last? Forever in our hearts. Really? I hope so. Can I... I can buy my own super sticker. It's a pair that's working out. Mark and I have been working out. Oh, well, Lazi just linked to me something. This is really what cool. What about working out? Working out. Azaria. What did Lazi um, link you? There's these fans making a 4K mod of Art of Artanelico. Really? Artanelico. Yeah. Artanelico. Yeah. I'll tell you though that when I had a CD player in my car, I had the Artonelico soundtrack in there. You're tough. You're the first person in my life I've heard say it like that. Dude, I have that shit on Vita. I got that rare. I got that rare shit. Arno that Search? rare, rare. Got that rare, rare. You did say that. that rare, rare. You guys want to see some rare shit? Yep. No, we don't want one. Oh boy. You want to see some rare shit? Yep. You do? Are you watching the stream right now, Mark? Yep. You want to see some rare shit? I just don't know if it's up to date. Yeah, but okay. Are you the guy in there? Yeah, okay. Hold on. I need to find this item. It's really pissing <laughs> me off that I can't. Got a strafe. Okay. I'm blogging right now, Nisa. I'm blogging. I'm for the rare shit. You gotta patch Azure, Nisa. You gotta do it. <laughs> you know, I know where you live, so show me where to rob you. <laughs> Don't say that, Victor. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> he does know where I live. I think. Now you have to move. Well, I'm moving now. Um, I would just check your bushes when you leave your house every day. How'd you know I had bushes? 
I'm assuming you got bushes and Victor's gonna be hiding in them so you would check them. I will tell you guys though that there is my garage has been was is converted into a room. So it's not an actual garage. And it's Mark Mark Shack? It's either gonna be a Mark Shack, a Mark Fuck Palace, or um the my next um home office where I'm gonna move everything out there. Oh, Johnny, I sh I've been streaming every um, Thursday, right, Bailey? Yeah. Every Thursday. In a way, yeah. Sometimes I just stream PS2 games. <laughs> we beat the bouncer on PS2. <laughs> that was that. Yeah, that was brilliant. <laughs> Zario almost lost his fucking mind doing that. Oh though. yeah, I I think I think I wanted to cry. I've never. I never wanted to cry more. Well, that's not, it, it wasn't that bad. On top, on now. You know what? I think I think I I, I really would have liked to oh, no. to um to have heard it a little more. I didn't have my audio set up very nicely. This, I think was a tough. Oh. oh, this girl's scary. Oh my god, she's very scary. Yeah, the bouncer playthrough, you can beat the game in two and a half hours. Three, 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 three. But it took me three because I kept dying. Well, I didn't know how to play, and then the people in the chat started teaching me how to play. Very cool. Oh, yeah, I was going to show you a rare game. Oh, what, what the game was there right now? This is a to keep in line with a horror game. To keep in line, this is Echo Knight Beyond on PS2. From I, th I think I think I've seen Nitro uh, do a video on that. Oh, yeah, it's like a space horror game. I'll read the back for you. Twenty forty four, not too long off. It's almost it's almost there. It's almost coming. We're almost at the at that year. Um, wait, let me. The top says, "Can you uncover the mysteries of the beyond?" Question mm mark. -hmm. Twenty forty four, Moon Colony. A horrific crash has left you separated from your fiance, opening the door to the lunar colony. Two hundred and nine, two hundred and thirty nine thousand miles from Earth. That's very specific. Ooh, it's Jack Human. You find a desolate base haunted by the sp Oh, sorry. I <laughs> I've, been okay? I've been drinking. Okay? I've been drinking. Uh, oh haunted God. by the spectral remains of those who called it home. Prepare to embark on a paranormal journey to the beyond. It has some uh, bullet points here. Beyond. Got fog, shadows, and weightless gravity engulf you in and out of this world experience. Stunning environments and dynamic camera changes will leave you trembling in fear. Challenging puzzles and heart-pounding exploration will take you to the edge and beyond. I'm scared. Oh, Johnny Q, you, you're beautiful. Thank you. Johnny Q, please, oh man. Please know, Johnny, that um, we do have... Uh, a Patreon. Uh, if you ever want to support oh, yeah. us, we we should have we should have linked that in the description. We have it on we have it on the we have it on the stream. Um, sorry I didn't put it in, but we do have a Patreon. Anybody who's watching, we do have a Patreon. Um, that goes that Patreon is directly for our staff writers and for um some of the content that we have coming up. I haven't I uh, I'm working on a new podcast coming up and I'm really excited about it. So, um, that's gonna be there um so if ever you anybody wants to directly uh support us and and just get some behind the scenes of how we do the day-to-day -day and go about this weird industry um please check it out um hey jack jack human i'm glad you're here <laughs> yeah. thank you for hanging out again jack 
Is that right now? Yes. Can I ping Nisa in this tweet? Um. What's the headline? It's, it's just uh -oh. it's just trails uh -oh. to Azure enemy scan preventing achievement. You're so angry. I'm mad. So you really did it though. What do you mean? You really did what you had to do to get it. Like you know it's not working. It is, it is just, yeah, I reinstalled. I verified integrity of the fucking system files. I went back in the game. I tried to scan it. The what's going on is that in the enemy notebook it says I haven't scanned it. In the battle it says I have scanned, it. but it's not registered in the notebook, which is which is weird. It's supposed to matter. And you took the screenshot. Yeah, I took both screenshots. Hey, dude, you did. You did your due diligence. By all means, at them. <laughs> My God. I gotta at them, bro. I'm fucking mad. Bailey, I'm Bailey mad. rarely gets mad, but when it comes to trails, <laughs> really. <laughs> One dog and it's over. It's either trails or Kingdom away. Hearts for Bailey. Come on, you son. You gotta fix it, bro. You gotta fix it. <laughs> he just, it's really just thing? for him it's really just for you though to get your platinum yes 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 it is <laughs> I don't I mean whatever Bailey's the editor in chief I, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna dispute what do you, what do you oh you're oh fuck is Ryuji here to fight Ryuji to fight, fight, dude. Ryuji I don't. Let him know what I you mean, let, let him know how you truly feel. I just want to say, isn't Azure not out yet technically? Ooh. So you know, uh, I gotta I gotta look up. No, Ryuji, I can't. I got in. Yeah, it is technically Ryuji. not out. I gotta inform them, Ryuji. But at I least they know I now. I mean, we could have sent them an email. I mean, I didn't do the tweet yet, but I I do want to do. It. Uh, should we send them an email? Should we? Let's not at them, but let's do send them an email. <laughs> yeah. Should I still write the article then? Yeah. So I really like so post that. the article, yeah. but don't at them. Okay. 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 And then well, write in the article that will that we've reached out to to Nisa, and I'll email them right now. However. <laughs> this is so stupid. After I kill this ghost, I'll send I'll send a nice a kindly worded email. You guys are seeing this live. The BTS. Yeah, I'm gonna say, should we even be talking about stuff like this? It doesn't matter, Ryuji. It doesn't matter. The game's up. The game. The embargo's up. It doesn't matter. When is the book behind the scenes of Noisy Pixel, dude? That that story, that story is full of drugs, partying, and rock and roll. No, it's not. Hell yeah. <laughs> it's Azario going through <laughs> depression several times. Multiple relationships. <laughs> Yelling at Mark. <laughs> In Seattle. <laughs> what did you you didn't yell at me in Seattle? I got so I got so worked up in Seattle. Uh oh, is that oh on the sidewalk. Yeah. Oh, I guess I was getting mad at you. Yeah, we were both getting a little mad. But it was mostly my fault. You were just overthinking it the situation. It was mostly my fault. I was... It's usually, it's usually, it's usually your fault. It's usually my fault. It's usually your fault. It's like Azario tried to tell everyone, Guys, stop writing reviews! <laughs> I parked my car in front of my neighbor's house and I didn't leave my house bad. for so long that he came and like said, asked me to move it. And I was, I was thinking like, dude, what? like you actually like walked over here just to tell me to move my car just cause he wanted to park right there. I mean, that's fair enough, right? Not really. Yeah, cause we have a whole street enough. that he could park on, but he wants to park right oh, in front of his, you're on here. his area though. Dude, he doesn't own the street, Mark. Yeah, but it's like the unspoken law. Mark, it's not New York, curb. bro. It's not, we don't have street cleaner or anything. 
No one parks on next. Why would you not park next to your house? That's what I want to know. Okay, but yeah, I was having a. I was. I don't know why. Well, <laughs> I don't know why I parked over there. It was just feeling like a. And then you didn't a, move it at all. A change of pace. I moved it. I said, oh, okay, no problem. Yeah, but how long did it take, though? But I was in. I, see, I was here for like three or four days because I would, never left. I was just editing videos. And crying. The grind. <laughs> he, they, the neighbor couldn't handle the grind. You're crying? I'm hurting. <laughs> neighbor down. Oh, so this guy? This is the bad guy. He's not a, he He's kid, a bad he guy. Kidnaps, he kidnaps little girls. Monka, yeah. monka. <laughs> A little bit yeah. of manka Luckily, in my tomorrow, life. I think the only videos and reviews we have going out are Mato. And I actually have a Gundam Evolution um, video going out. <laughs> God damn it, Bailey. <laughs> it's always the same It's sound, always the same it. sound. <laughs> Johnny Q. Consistency. Shh. Johnny. <laughs> You're. You're fucking insane, and thank you. Um, holy shit, holy oh my shit, God, Johnny. Johnny Q. Oh my God, Johnny. Johnny, um, like, honestly, like, <clears throat> real talk, though, now that we're talking about Noisy Pixel, it's a lot, it's it's all of our lives. I think, um, I, at least the people on this call, Mark, myself, um, Bailey, and Ryuji, like, we care a mm -hmm. lot about this uh website and i and i really do appreciate that you're hanging out and stuff but um also honestly the patreon is like more than enough that we can ask for too so <clears throat> just think yeah just think about uh the patreon and stuff <laughs> why don't they say that johnny is the new owner <laughs> Johnny's our investor. <laughs> Johnny's investing. He owns the biggest percentile of yeah. Noisy Pixel. <laughs> I was trying to exercise on my elliptical, and and one of my arms, my arm, one of my arms broke I on know. and smacked me in the nuts. I'm having a bad. Oh my god, <laughs> Jack Cuban. Oh no. That's why you gotta you gotta not use the elliptical. Well, actually, the elliptical is one of the best exercises because it's so, like, um, low effort and low tension on your muscles and stuff. So if you're trying to um, just get in cardio and you're not trying to hurt your um, – you're not trying to hurt your, uh, like, your knees or anything, elliptical is the way to go. I'm trying to get this. Oh, I already got that, girl. But it's not. Registering. Scenario, the article's up, bro. You didn't tag them? No. Okay. I will I will email them. This is so stupid. I guarantee I'm the on the like maybe it's just me. I don't maybe it's just me. There's a there's a good life DLC. Yeah, there is. Yeah, they announced it recently. I don't think we covered it. I'm gonna forward it to you. It's out now. I don't know. Okay. Um. Yeah, I started with the elliptical, Jack. I started doing it. Um, I was doing it for like eight months. I think forty-five minutes a day. And honestly, it, you don't you don't get winded. You do sweat. And it works upper and lower body if you're doing the arm thing it looks dumb as hell though like you do not look cool doing the elliptical that's the biggest problem if you're trying to look cool elliptical is not the way to go um but i did it i did it for about eight months and then i i switched over to running on a treadmill i did run outside a few times but um but it started hurting my knees, um, and my ankle started hurting, and I was wearing like braces and stuff, but never really. Uh, worked. I gotta, I gotta. Unless you're Mark, yeah, Mark always looks a consistent, a consistent cute. Like he's always like, oh, Mark looks nice. 
Um, Damn, I'm cool. This DLC has 12 new side quests. Um, I gotta go to the bathroom again. Uh, Bailey. Mm. I need your help with something. Mm -hmm. So the image that I just DM'd you. Yeah. Can you can you do a manual tweet on it? What's this for? I... Okay. <laughs> just 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 <laughs> publish it without without tweeting them. Okay. Yeah, so it's because the it's because the proportions are wrong. Like the the article has a certain feature, then if I, I can okay. change that from here. Mm, okay. Um, yeah. You could definitely support us through our Patreon. I very much so appreciate the donations. But if you want to get involved directly, yeah, you should subscribe yeah, to the Patreon. Yeah, the, the Patreon more directly supports us, um, mm. if you'd rather do it that way. Yeah, so here's the thing with YouTube, is that YouTube Super Chats, YouTube takes a, takes a small cut of that. With the Patreon, I don't think they do. Well, well, that, well, like that, and and also <laughs> help yeah, you also too, get benefits, which is, which yeah, is yeah. like a win-win situation. You support us, we give you special benefits. It's a win-win situation. When are we gonna get the Ryuji DLC? When, when are we gonna have the Ryuji weekly pop quiz series? Yeah, Ryuji teaches us kanji. It's the Ryuji show, honestly. Yeah, I'm trying to look for the this Ryuji item, show. and I. I, I fucking hate this. I hate looking for items. The Ryuji show. It sounds like you hate this game as well, yeah. No, this is just old, old like, Wii stuff. Like, this is a system from the Wii. Mm. The Wii. And, like, before you would just point your Wiimote at crap. And, uh, but now it's like, oh, it's just so hard. Um, Lozy, Lozy's live in our hearts, though, at all times. Lozy, I feel like you've been here for a very long time, too. I feel like I always, like, in, like, unqualified game chat and stuff. I don't know, we're, did Lozy listen to our show, Mark? What was our show? Talking bits. Talking bits. <laughs> Talking shits. Bought this Best game from your ever. review, and it's much better than Made in the Blackwater Port. It, it, it still has its issues. So far, enjoying it. Yeah, Mark. I say, I say this. This is much better than uh, Made in the Blackwater. I like the setting more. I like the story. I can follow the story way better. Um, I, I don't know. And you know what? I never play I never played this one. I I played Made in a Blackwater. Um I remember when they first launched the game, they put a demo out, so that's when I played it. I played the demo. But um I never wanted to buy it because I was like back then, you guys, I was super militant like F Nintendo, they changed uh was that SMT game or uh, the uh the, the uh, idol game? Tokyo, Tokyo Mirage Tokyo Session. Tokyo Mirage Session. F Nintendo. They censored oh. Tokyo Mirage Sessions. I was writing pieces on it. Oh, boy. I, uh, young as Art. To be young as Ario again. Ario was heated. I was, I was definitely a gamer. And <laughs> really, yeah. like. You're, you're not as much as, like, you're not as, as, as much of a gamer now. Yeah. I'm too old now. Um, Zario, yes. I just, I just published something about Genshin Impact. Are you proud of me? That's all I ever wanted. <laughs> That's all I ever wanted. Um, yeah, Mark. I do, I do think that the, um, 
that the uh, that it's cool that there is a map, but I never really need to use it. <laughs> Couldn't run anything current, and the least I did was play them just once. Um, Lozy, so you probably know this, but for other people, um, I wanted Noisy Pixel to be like successful just to get more people to notice uh, visual novels. Um, I just I just feel like the thing about visual novels is they'll release, but other visual novel websites that, that review them, oh man, they'll take like four or five months. And I was like, like that's that's too long. That's too long. Like these people need help making like a choice now. So, so with Noisy Pixel, I was like, I'm gonna start talking to these companies, try to get the visual novels earlier, um, see what we can see, what we can do. Um, yeah, Mark, I tried them for the art as well. <laughs> Just to see, just I, you know what? I just want to fall in love. <laughs> That's what visual novels do. Um, but you know what I'm saying? Like, just uh, just get more people onto them and get a review out sooner. And um, I don't know. I feel like I feel like to an extent it works. Um, art art has worked. Um. And even when we, and even we're even when we're getting bigger now, Bailey can probably notice. I mean, Bailey probably notices as much as anybody else. But um, we have kind of like distanced ourselves from like not no like people are our our reviewers aren't reviewing as many visual novels, but we're I I make sure that we stay on it i have an ear i um, i wouldn't say we're distancing like it's it's just like because we still do it a lot we still do it a lot yeah the volume of what we cover usually like it it's a lot i think i think well i think that has to do with like our capacity and the fact that um like you want to you want to review um I mean, we can say, well, you're, you're playing Nope, Nope, Nope Nurses right now. <laughs> yeah, I know, yeah. <laughs> uh, but the reason why that's not up is just because there's way too many games. And it's like, okay, let me yeah. let me sit here and and and, and read this visual novel. And st it's the, it does take, it does take a long time, but um, I don't know. We're, st we're still focused on it. Ivanir is still here to... Um, Ivanir is like the real like visual novel. Mark, we want to. Um I want to even do like a Patreon visual novel show. Um the problem is is getting getting the it's just too much getting, right now. Yeah, getting it's too much, but getting also getting the right people to do it. You know what I'm saying mm -hmm. too? Like getting the Yeah, like I, I am surprised Lazar hasn't mentioned like Otome games, which are my niche. Oh yeah, Ryuji, Ryuji's the Otome. You know. We are, we are probably, we are one of the few outlets I think that does come. Yeah. At least one of the more prominent ones, because we, we don't really ever see like typical news outlets do that. Mm -hmm. Ryuji, can you get me the answer to this? I think, wait, I, I do, I think I remember. Uh... Actually, I know, I know it, I know it. I remember it. I'm not that drunk. You know it? You know it? I know it. Is there an item here? Sometimes I think that they're like showing me an item that's like behind the wall or something. Like clip like clipping on the wall. Cause I swear to god, look at I'm like literally combing this wall and it's telling me there's an item here and nothing i don't like this swear to 
he developed this game, right? Or is he part of the uh, Swery, yeah. He um Okay. Still waiting for D four to finish. Yeah, Mark, I don't know what it is. I I swear that sometimes I do it. And what sucks is like I just I just found out right now that I even missed like a really um cool cutscene last time I played. Um because it didn't it wasn't even shining. I guess I just had to check like a a mirror or something but it wasn't even shiny i can't i can't waste time just like standing here looking at a fucking wall i don't i don't think it's suda oh I, no I no think... suda 51 uh wrote this game he helped he helped really play. um oh oh it's both of them okay sure no 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 this game um oh fatal, fatal, fatal. Okay, okay. <laughs> not he, oh so um Bailey's Bailey was talking more about the uh, the Good Life DLC just came out today. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Under that. Um. Wait, I do know it. Hold on. Let me get that. Um. Yeah, Suda Fifty One, uh, Grasshopper Interactive, I think, did this. Um. Uh, help develop it at least uh two seven i think it's i think it's six guys two hold on to your butts did it work <gasps> did it um mark if you look on our website we have an interview with the director um Please go check it out. Um, honestly, I think I will. Sh I'll reshare it because I think it got lost in the um, the news. But I got the director to tell a story about Suda Fifty One, and it's it's really cool. Um, when I do when I do interviews, I tend to want to ask about like uh, previous like experiences and stuff like that that the developers have because I mean, you can know about a video game by watching trailers or by looking at the website or something um and i mean this game has been this game has been around for a very long time um so uh, yeah we do have a i do want i do urge people to go check out that review so i think i'm behind that wall right now and it's still going blue so does that mean that oh, there's a goddamn ghost getting in my way I'm trying to find items over here, ghost. Grasshopper manufacturer. Oh man, he did not care. Um, but sweary insert if you want our friends too. How many, um, is there, uh, in the object? Oh. I wanted to tell a story, but I'll tell it after I beat the ghost. <laughs> um, I'll tell my um my Suda Fifty One story. Um, that I love telling. Oh wait, I think I still have to. Oh my God! <gasps> oh, I had the. See, that's what I'm saying. You guys have that mirror. You survive, but he's a. Uh, this guy is. Uh, some enemies can transform into like stronger enemies, but it's random. Anyway, my suit fifty one story. So um, he was doing press for twenty uh, fifth ward, and um, and Kodaka was doing press for Danganronpa V three, I think at the time, and. Um, so I was able, NIS was publishing both of them, so I got to do an interview with both of them in uh, San Francisco. And, uh, and, uh, when I was interviewing Suda51, I, I just, 
I didn't because like on these press junkets they have so many press people go through there that the that the that they answer the same question over and over and over again and it's like it's like okay um I got to be clever or whatever um so I asked about like his I I I just talked to to him about films the whole time because if you if you play 25th Ward, which you should if you like visual novels and adventure games, it is literally fucking awesome. Um, it's a lot. It's it, he takes after. He, it's like a Godard film. So we just started talking about Godard and like, like old movies and just like old directors. And um, he liked he he ended up he ended up really liking me. So he told Nisa that we were gonna go that we wanted to go to like the the bar after. And so him, him, me, and Kodaka, Kodaka went to the uh, this this club place, this bar place, and the music like sucked. I guess like Suda Fifty One didn't like the music, so he went up to the DJ, and he told the DJ, uh, basically, uh, this music sucks. Let me DJ. He plugs in his phone, and for the rest of the night, he plays music up there, and. <laughs> just his music <laughs> and it was like wow. it was just a really cool like like suit of 51 punk rock like if you ever wondered like is this guy who he says he is in like these punk rock scenes like he is he is absolutely that that man and uh and for the rest of the night uh kodaka and i talked about chiaki's uh breasts <laughs> And that, you told the story like like ten times. I, yeah, but I've never told it to like general audience. I've always yeah, told it like, yeah, yeah. like to um, other staff writers. But um, Lippers, you're welcome. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so so Kodaka, the way it, the way it came out, he's I was like, who's your favorite character? And he's like, through a through an interpreter, through an NIS American interpreter. Um. I believe Alan was interpreting actually, and Alan and NAS America, he um, re he was the one who relocalized um, East Eight. So, I mean, oh. pretty big name in the East community, I guess. But anyway, he was translating for Kodaka, and, and he was like, "No, I don't want to hear about my favorite character. I want to hear about yours." And I was, and he was like, uh, "Who is it?" And I was like, "Oh, Chiaki." And he's like, "Why?" And I was like, uh, "Oh, okay. I was like, oh, bye." <laughs> <laughs> and he I and he smiles that. at me and he's like me too <laughs> oh, <good Lord. laughs> it's a very uh yeah it was a very fun uh fun uh night it was one of the, it's probably like one of the best what if the what if fucking alan say that oh he he well since since I said Opai like he, I mean Kodaka knew what I was saying. He just yeah, Alan yeah. just laughed. Okay. Um. <laughs> yeah, Alan just laughed. Uh, or those wandering Opai is boobs. Yeah. I, just saying. <laughs> I mean, there's girls with bigger breasts in that game. There's a couple of other fun like industry stories I had like. One time I was at an uh, anime expo and I was there's like the day before anime expo they had like interviews that you could do and um and they never tell you about them so sometimes they just yeah, ha- sometimes they just have a bunch of great names and nobody's interviewing nobody's there to interview them except for like photographers and stuff at anime expo a lot of photographers go to these events for like Japanese magazines and stuff um very little press go and so when i went <clears throat> they have like a hall and all these like rooms and you walk past the rooms and some of the doors are closed some of the doors are open so there was an uchikoshi like um interview cool. room so i interviewed uchikoshi and i'm walking out and i'm i'm walking out of the room and i look into the next room over and it's fucking sakaguchi uh, sitting with the art designer, I can't think of his name right now. Sorry, uh, the art designer for uh, Dragon Guard, and <laughs> and uh, 
and I ask, and he's with like the Mistwalker um, marketing team, and I ask if I can um, interview him. And they're like, yeah. Um, so we talk about uh, well, Terra Battle, you know, like, but I'm just like trying to do the stuff, and um, it was probably one of like the coolest like moments of of my like career is like um being able to sit at a table with uh Sakaguchi and then um yeah and then uh like you got to contain yourself though because you can't freak out um so afterwards oh, yeah. I freaked out like I I interviewed him very very respectfully talked about Dragon Guard tra- talked about Yokotaro um talked about um Mistwalker stuff um but afterwards I was like oh you have no idea you have no idea how you changed my yeah. life I bet your brain must have been like did I did I just interview fucking dude I was like I yeah it was a very uh it's just one of those moments, and, and it and it happened so quick that I I wasn't even uh, like expecting it. I wasn't even expecting it. Um, Johnny Q, <laughs> you don't. I let me just be drunk and talk about. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh my god! <sighs> Holy shit, Johnny! Dear Lord. Holy. Good Akaspa. lord, Johnny. Akaspa, domorigato. Thanks for the red super chat. Fuck, man. My goodness gracious. In 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 all actuality, like, like seriously, like, thank you. We we have um six people going to PAX this this week and or this this month at the end of the month and what what anybody does to the site when they share a video sh- like an article uh, donate anything to our patreon subscribe at all um that all goes directly to um those opportunities for us and it just means the fucking world like johnny you do, in no way do you ever have to do that um and never feel that never feel that you have to um but we do appreciate it and just, I swear, like, just sharing our video with someone else is so much to us. And Mark and I kind of talk about this all the time. When we first launched, I think we had, like, I don't know, a few hundred subscribers from, like, my old YouTube channel. Because um, we converted it to Noisy Pixel just for those few hundred subscribers. Um, but, uh, um, it didn't matter, like the when we hit 500 to when we hit a thousand to when we hit 20,000 subscribers every time it was the same partying it was the same like like energy like it doesn't matter like the numbers or whatever we we've always like celebrated every uh milestone with so much excitement and i don't know and don't ever feel like you like you're already doing enough just hanging out with us. Um, but I'm gonna cry. So. <laughs> I'm gonna stop. <laughs> Wonder Rosario not crying. <sighs> um. Fuck. Um. Say fucking say something, Bailey. Say more. <laughs> say something. <laughs> oh my god. You. Um. I didn't know. I didn't know playing Fatal Frame, um, uh, with bathing suits on would make me cry. Arousal those strange things from that of the arena. That's not that's not cool. You can only car- carry one mirror stone. Nope, nope, nurses. Nope, 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 <laughs> nope, nurses. 
Fuck. I don't know what to say. I'm like very loss of loss of words. Oh, like we, we've. Oh, he, you've done the Patreon too. Thank you, Johnny. Like um. I like I. I I. I'm kind of glad we waited this long, because I feel like we did it early. I like I I feel like we were too we be too in over our heads. In yeah, that's a in in terms of like Patreon, I think people do um, launch way too early. Yeah, like I think now we're in like like now we we still have like to, we have to, we still have to like be careful with how. Yeah, I feel like now. Yeah, we, I feel like we, now we, our like basis like, is um. Conceptualize the Patreon. We tried our best to not like. Oh, we're gonna release like ten different tiers. Yeah, like now our. Our workload like is so high, but like we have a pretty good, like we're a lot more organized than we used to. Yeah. Well, and I think that has to do with like, even like, people like Ryuji being more comfortable around the website, people in you being more comfortable having your voice in in articles and sharing like stuff that I never thought to share before you got here. You know, like, you're you opened up new. Um, I don't know, expanding past the press releases, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I mean, like... Because before you got here, it was just, like, all, all I had time to do was the press releases. But being able to share more than that does a, did a lot for us as well. Yeah, the yeah, press releases know. are... They're, they're only, like, a pretty... Like, they're only just... Happening for the most part. Like, there's usually... A... Um... um Megazuna, uh, hiring, hiring right now is like, that's that's what our Patreon's for is to open up um, more writing opportunities. Um, right now, yeah, right now, we're, I mean, right now we're we're, we're, we're basically we're almost a volunteer website. Um, for the most part, we are. For the most yeah. part, um, for the most part, yeah. Um, the money that we do get uh, goes to. Um, like E3 or PAX Anime Expo for like flights or for hotels. Um, so the riders attending events don't have to put out for, for that kind of stuff. Um, because essentially, I mean, you're covering a lot over there. Um, but we're, we're, we are hoping to, um, to break out of that and, and grow, grow bigger. Um, this is our year though, I think. I think you said, I think you said that for the past two years, and it's always been. It's always been. If you say so. Yeah, Gabby, I feel like I said this in, on Twitter the other day. I feel like Noisy Pixel is the best website that not everybody knows about. <laughs> you know, like what? But once they find us, they're like, "Oh shit!" Like, who are these? Well, like, we we also like we also just we cover a lot of niche things for the most years, so. That True, yeah. Maybe we gotta start covering Call of Call of Duty. Do Call of Duty. <laughs> yeah, it's niche things. I sh I mean, I reviewed Call of Duty. <laughs> we did. I forgot about. It. Yeah, we did. I reviewed Madden. <laughs> you did. You put that with your dad, right? Yeah. I played it with my dad. <laughs> We bonded over it. That's fucking absurd. <laughs> we've never, we've never like played a game together. Oh my god, Johnny Q, dude. Johnny, oh. you gotta calm down. <laughs> Jesus. I swear, Bailey's a way better streamer than I am. Oh lord. Another Akut. Uh, that that not oh god. Oh, I recall Duty. Yeah, like Call of Duty. Like, yeah. I I don't know how I don't know how accurate it is. If every one is the same, <laughs> I don't, I don't know if that's really true. 
It probably is true to an extent. The year, the the year of uh, Noisy Pixel for sure. Like, year Noisy Pixel. We fixed the website. That's something we did. Oh yeah, so the website. Yeah, the, this this shit really irked. A little bit of backstory. This like. If um uh what okay so um your mic your mic cuts out but I will tell you that Bailey's getting a new mic we 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 sent Bailey a new mic <laughs> so, I'm getting a new mic so I'm getting, it cuts I'm off sometimes but it's not gonna be like that for very long um I'm getting a new one soon buggers and that's a direct yeah, the, that's um, a result that is a result of uh Patreon we'll say that that <laughs> uh just from like upgrades and stuff um this is like a six year old Samsung Go mic. So. Dude, um, I need to hear Bailey in my ear though. Keep it further away from the mouse. Oh, the the scroll wheel. Oh, the scroll wheel. Let's let's, let's hear it. Oh, it's not. It's not. I can't hear it anymore. You can't hear it no. anymore. Really? It was so. Like, it was wait. so audible before. That, that's so weird because it's like right next to it. Um. Oh, so last year, last year. We we got off of um, Bluehost, and we got onto SiteGround. But when we were on Bluehost, you guys, the website crashed maybe every hour. It was so bad, bro. Um, it was so bad. I'm using I'm using Sure. Um, Bailey is Bailey's using a Samsung, but he's going to be using uh the Yeti X, which I was using before. Um, it's a good mic. Um, yeah, yeah, he's okay. Yeah, that's the thing. It's like, it gets the job done. Um, so before I got this one, all the videos that you hear, um, it's about to be, it's, it's about to be, be, um, be a lot better than what I have. So I don't really mind. Yeah. I mostly got this, um, because I wanted to start streaming this year. Like I'm kind of, I was, there's, there's, it's always been like an upward battle for Mark to get me on camera just cause I don't like, I don't always, I don't know. I don't like looking at myself. I feel like, I feel like everyone looks at themselves for too long nowadays. It's like your, your pictures in your avatar, your pictures on your Facebook, your pictures are tagged. And it's like, God, how many, uh, Ry Ryuji goes the 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 um VTuber route. He has his own uh, yes. He has his own VTuber guy going. <laughs> it's cool. Yes, I for for those wondering, I basically use an avatar that that I I have a, I commissioned an artist to create like this. There's there's a very simple way. You just commission commission artists to create like four states, which is mouth open, mouth closed, eyes open, eyes closed, and then there's a program where it will cycle those to make sure it's like as if you're blinking and speaking. It's really cool. Like it's free too. Yeah, well, Zario, guess what article right now? Is it the Azure thing? It's the Azure thing, baby. Wow. <sighs> Really? People are mad. <laughs> My gosh. Are people mad though? Well, they did. They did lift live streaming embargo too. So it's like, I don't know. Huh? Somebody, someone else could have found that. Not just you. You know, anybody could have found that. That's live streaming it right now. Oh, for Azure? Yeah. Yeah, maybe. I like it. It's a very minor thing. If you want to get the platinum, kind of cocky. <laughs> um, oh, so about the website. So it was crashing a lot, and we transferred it over to SiteGround. So we had, we're on a cloud server now. But we had huge connection issues, you guys. The back end moved super slow. Um, it would connect we had connection issues oh my god azario Az azario and i would do events 
Oh, we'd yeah. like cover events, and like it would it would just cut off in the middle. Yeah. So if we, so if like a Nintendo event was going on, we would have to stop writing because it would say uh, connection issue. Um, so finally, we we saved up uh, enough to um, to get a developer in there. So I built the website originally, but I, um, when the fact the site grounds on a cloud server and that's in a, it's in a it's in a different language that I don't really understand or don't know uh, too well on it, Bluehost was a little easier for me on a server level, but um but so we we were able to buy we were able to pay um. A developer to to look through it for us and oh man changed well yeah we 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 paid one the first time oh yeah we paid one and he didn't do anything <laughs> i still i still wonder what the heck did he do well, well no he did something because it, like it was yeah he did something yeah, like, it, it... It felt it felt like he it felt like oh I see this issue and then he just put a a band aid on top of it and eventually the band aid just like wore off or something. I, yeah, I don't know because it got bad again, huh? Like pretty pretty yeah, quick. Yeah, but like now, been, how many weeks was it? One week, two weeks? It was like a, and, a week or two, yeah. Yeah. So and basically, me and Bailey well, at whenever. I still, I still remember that day. So me and Bailey were covering, I forgot what event now. And then like, we, there was no one online. Azar wasn't responding to me or, or Bailey. And they were like, Sounds about oh, it. <laughs> we are fun. <laughs> Azar is not responding. Because no one else can take a look at this. So what, yeah, uh, you guys are having super bad issues too that morning, huh? It was just, it was, like it's it's just, it's just, like the worst problem to have because yeah with the site of our size like being timely is the most important thing so when you, so when you wear like ruins mm -hmm. reach really really rough um Gabney, I I actually um so this is so you're in luck because I'm not really spoiling anything but um I I really like this game it has it's it has its problems. But for a straightforward like survival horror, oh, for a straightforward survival horror, I think it's great. I'm a I'm actually having more fun playing on um, hard mode. Um, so how 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 many of the games are still been ported? I think we have all of them now. Do we? Oh shit! Sure, okay, <laughs> they're gonna make a new fatal frame. <laughs> they can't make a new fatal frame. Oh hi Archie. Yeah, um thanks for watching the Paranormal site. I'm really glad that I was able to um share that with people. Yeah. You're not the only one. Like I a lot, I got a lot of messages from people saying that they didn't even hear about that game and I think Square Enix is just yeah, Square's they, marketing they, is they so don't bad. know. Like, how do so, how do so, I so market an adventure game? So, Let's do it. Here's some here's some here's some nice juicy backstory. The, so like we we didn't know anything about the like a couple of days ago prior to azario got the code for it um uh, oh no actually i think it is when you um we we found out that the character just that the character designer for it was the same one or uh as the one from the world on from the world ends with you yeah and the, the only way we found that out was on the app store because the game's also on mobile yeah and yeah. Square, square did not tell people about this so like we we only found out about found out about that by chance. How many yeah. people would have been yeah. excited if they like, if they like were to market it with that? Yeah, you know, like, like it's it, it's such a bizarre. So if the if the audio cut from you, um, the Square Enix, uh, d d we, I mean, we looked at the the i the Apple Store and it said that the um the artist for the game was from the world's end with you and uh and no one even, no one wrote about it i think so what what someone on twitter said that it was like a it was like a spanish like fan thing i think or something oh oh um bailey did you ask which of the which of them haven't been ported yet 
Yeah. yeah. Oh, I guess then one through three have not been ported. They're still on the the PlayStation Two. Um. Um. Mark, I'll show you something cool right now after I beat this ghost's ass. Oh, she's strong. Oh fuck. Fucking die, is our. It's okay. I have um sacred water, and I have um. <laughs> Archie, I'm one of the few Final Fantasy VII <laughs> first soldier players who was heartbroken when it closed. <laughs> oh my god, I just noticed, I just noticed this. I think Ryuji played that so, game. So, um, so you know how Johnny Q gave us, like, two, like, like, two red super chests? Yeah. Oh, it it ends it adds it to the top of the screen. Yeah. Yes, it adds it to the top. Of the screen, but uh, something I I think of, something happened with like so you know how you have the chat on your overlay, Azario? Yeah. It kind of broke. It, it's not registering the the super chats properly. <laughs> Is it? I see wait, wait. I see it on mine. Yeah, it looks fine. Oh, to me. Oh. Oh, um, Lozzy, I think Azari's talking to the Mark. Oh, Mark, uh, I don't know, I don't know if Mark's here right now. Um, yeah. I'm talking to the Mark in the, in the chat. Yeah, I think Mark, I think our Mark left. Mark with the C. <laughs> um, I'll show, Mark, I'm going to show you something, uh, cool when, uh, when I beat this ghost. But... Yeah, so, so, like, the Outer Worlds got, like, I guess. <laughs> oh, or so I heard. Oh, we we got it. So that's my fault. Is we did get a review copy in that game, but we didn't have capacity to. I didn't have capacity to re-review it. So um. Oh, yeah. Apparently, it's pretty bad. Man, do you get like? Well, I got a fatal frame. These guys are pretty hard. That was like one of my favorite. I liked that game too. Yeah, a lot of people like the Outer World, right? Um, thanks again for the review. I'll be sure to watch your channel if I ever a playthrough for it. Enjoy Fatal Frame. Thanks, Archie, and thanks for hanging out. Okay, Mark. What is Zari gonna get? Not too long ago, a warehouse. I think it was like last year or something. But they found a warehouse of unopened Fatal Frame three copies. So I was able to get an unopened copy of Fatal Frame three, the Tormented. It doesn't have like the the original like um uh sticker, PS two sticker, but it does it does have the fold and everything. But uh, pretty cool find on eBay. So these these usually go for expensive. But uh, the person, when it was like when Yakuza two, when they found a bunch of Yakuza two copies and it went down to like forty bucks. That's what happened here. Is it went down to uh, forty dollars. I remember. Um, so there was someone that I that I found that Square Enix had PS two like PS two copies and PS one of some Kingdom Hearts and Final Fantasy games, and some people actually managed to, like, nab them in mint condition. Oh, mint condition. I'll tell anybody, um, Square Enix has these holiday sales every year where they'll sell, like, 3DS games. I bought all the uh, Dragon Quest games for $20 each, and they're super rare. And, and I, bought, yeah, I bought them all new for $20. Rare. Just when it's holiday season... Just um Yeah, we also they also sell some like PS1 games. Yeah, they'll sell they'll sell like Chrono Trigger for like thirty dollars brand new. Um Yeah, it's uh it's tough when you wanna play like these old games and they're so expensive. It's it's because in the back of your head you're like, fuck, I either I'm gonna have to steal it or I'm gonna have to go my whole life without 
playing these games. Well, there's a, there is a third option. What's the third option? Not playing them? <laughs> Emulation. Oh, yeah, steal them. Yeah, you can steal them, for sure. I mean, like, well, like, the thing is, like... Yeah. If the platform is old enough, I don't think it... So, well, at one point, I was gifted a bo an unopened box of, like, these this PS2 game, like, Graffiti something. I forgot the name. But I was gifted a whole uh, box of them, like a PS2 box of them, unopened. Um... And uh, they were all, um, they were going for like $90, $100 on eBay. And I decided to put them on eBay for $20 each. And I, and I completely fucked the market on them. <laughs> and I like lowered the price of all of them. So you could do it. Really... Like you can like control the market of like. I'm sorry, you're playing with the economy. Yeah, you could just play, you could play with the used market like that. Um, it's pretty funny. That, oh, your friend's selling them and not market price. I, I suck at, I, I do suck at selling games. If I, if I own a game, um, I don't, I don't sell stuff. Um. I'm just too lazy. <laughs> um, I did have a, yeah, I always hear like stories of like people going to flea markets and stuff, but I don't even go to flea markets. And I, I, I try to find stuff in the wild, but it's getting harder because people do know the prices of games and it just, I don't know. Yeah. I never hit flea markets. I, there was a time where, like, I think at my most, I don't know, like, when I was super, like, sad and, like, unhappy, I, I would buy a lot of new games because it would, like, give me that, that rush. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, just, like, every NIS America limited edition, even if I knew I didn't have the money, even if I knew it was, like, just going on, like, a debt credit card, dude, I would, I would buy it. It was bad. It was bad for a long time. Um, and, and I just felt like I had to have it, had to, yeah, I had to have every, every limited run game that came out. I had to have the Vita and the PS4 cop. I was, that was fucking weird. Um, you're, you're kind of reminding me of how, like of what I did recently. <laughs> when you bought your 3DS? No, I, I lost the option. Oh, fuck. Huh. But like importing stuff from Japan, I'm like, okay, so my my purchase has books. They're not gonna tax me, and I get the email from customs saying <laughs> I was taxed. But like, and they're like, pay up, bitch. Yeah, but I was I was more buying stuff because like, it it was the no, only like, thing. It at the time it was the only thing that was making me happy. Yeah, I was like that too for a while. I would get limited. Like, I have limited editions for games I don't care about. Just because, like, I just wanted to get it. Oh, uh, dude. You know? I, I remember one time um, I was in college and I got financial aid and it was, like, the first time my checking account ever had, like, over $1,000 in it. Uh -huh. And uh, and I fucking bought Mugen Souls, the limited you edition. Bought, <laughs> you bought Mugen Souls? <laughs> Oh and then, no God. joke, a few months after I bought it for, like, I think it was, like, a hundred bucks or something. Um, oh, Lord. It went on sale for 40 Oh, my God. It was... Oh, no. <sighs> oh, yeah, Jason. The PlayAsia shipping is, like... <laughs> I, I mean, it could be cheap for their games, but... um. I mean, like, at least it's not as bad as, a, like, the fucking Bandai and Square. Mm, you... You guys, are, you guys are mentioning Play Asia losing packages. Like we had someone. From yeah, our staff Nate lost. Like, Nate lost his package, and they don't care. They won't. They'll. Yeah, they'll, yeah they don't care. They'll automatically blame yeah. the, uh, the shipping, or they'll say, "Nope, it said it entered the U.S. It's out of our hands." Nineteen. But even if that is true, it's it's not very good. Yeah. Customer so, service. I'm, 
I, I've had a friend say, why don't you just, why are you trying to do auctions on Yahoo Auctions? Can, like, PlayAsia has some some Nintendo DS, like, Nintendo 3DSs in stock still, and I'm like, I don't want them, I don't want it to get lost. Like, it, okay, if I, I, okay, if someone got their package lost, it happens. But when you see a lot of people complain about that same thing, you know something's wrong. <laughs> Like, I totally forgot the number for this, but I'm trying to guess it. Ryuji, tell me the number. <laughs> uh, let me check the. Let me. Check, uh, the, my live stream is is delayed. Do some time oh. travel on it. Do some time travel. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck? Are I know. I'm trying to brute force it. <laughs> no wait. I think I know. What the what is? No, 13 was the first one, Mark. I do... Oh, there. 23. The other 13. <laughs> the real 13. Did you manage to figure it out? Yeah. Ah. Oh. Missed that ghost, though. Uh. Versus 13th. Versus 13, baby. Quadratum. Quadratum. Remember when that Kingdom Hearts 4 trailer came oh. out? I mean, I, were, I had to... I was up the whole night. Just waiting. And Jacob was the only one... There to party. They were the only one, they were the only one in VC at like 6 a.m. They were panicking. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, play like it does suck that. Okay, so um, if ever you want to try it, Amazon Japan usually has the same stuff as Play Asia. Um, oh, well, they're actually a lot more reliable from what I've done. And they have better yeah. they have they just have better customer service. Yeah. Um, but it does. They damage some books. Yeah, they do. Oh my god, that's so real. They don't get. <laughs> they don't give a fuck about the books that they send over. They'll send them in like the like just just the cardboard slips. Who um play? Asia? No, just uh, Amazon Japan. Oh yeah, yeah. Amazon doesn't really. I'm doing pretty good. I thought I was gonna suck. I mean, he did look up like a guy like a good check of times. Oh, I thought these ghosts were gonna kill me a lot more. I'm gonna try to get that fatal frame. <laughs> oh! That's close. Maybe, maybe, could Azario be too good at a game? I don't think so. <laughs> Bailey's the real gamer. He beat, uh, that one cloud version of, uh, Kingdom Hearts, Kingdom Hearts Rebirth. Yeah. <laughs> he beat, okay, he beat, uh, the, okay, so beating the Kingdom Hearts games is one thing. He beat Yozora, Yozora, one of the hardest bosses in the game. On critical, using a cloud connection. Yeah, using cloud. Like, That's insane. Shit. That was that was very CBT. CBT. But you still did it. it. So. Yeah, her... Jason, we have the video on uh on um the YouTube channel where you can watch it, and he kind of yeah. he kind of walks you through uh what he had Pretty to bad. do. Yeah, we, we have the video on there. Bailey, Bailey. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's very, uh... I was watching it, too, and you can tell, like, his button inputs were, like, before, like, the reaction speed. Um, hey, Club, but I still can't believe they released that shit in Club. 
No one talks about it anymore. No one talks. Yeah, no one cares anymore. You know, it's all really bizarre to me. Um. Well, guys, uh, two and a half hours. I think uh, that's that's the stream. Um. Seriously, Johnny Q, thanks. Um, Lozy, thanks. Uh, Jason, always nice seeing you. Uh, Mark, it was cool talking to you. Um, and yeah, this was pretty. This was, I think, this might have been our longest stream, I think, next to the bouncer. Yeah. Um, I always, I love doing this. Um, at first, I was kind of scared to do it, but you guys have all made it really fun. So thank you so much for um, coming through. Next week, next Thursday, we'll be here hanging out. Bye, Victor. I love you too. Bye, guys. Um, but everybody guys. have a good night. Um, we have a noisy news flash up. I I haven't checked. Yeah, yeah. I haven't checked the comments on it because I've been streaming ever since I posted it. But um, check out our Patreon. Um, we have a Patreon. Um, we have some cool content coming oh, up. But yeah. um, if ever Johnny Q, I. <laughs> Just uh, add me on Twitter, Johnny Q. Let's be friends. <laughs> Let's just hang out. Uh, not not for anything, but I feel like I I need you to know that I am an uh, what is it approachable person. Like you're you're subscribing to us, but you're also subscribing to some real ass people, and um, not just not just virtually, but like if you go to an event, and say hi to hi to me. Like I'm down. I'm always down to hang out. I'm always down to to chill so thank you everybody for watching um yeah i'll see you soon bye Nothing.